What's up guys, it's your boy Ruin. We are back with another Yakuza Zero live stream. Let's get right into things, y'all. We're gonna continue from where we left off last Saturday evening. Um, we have finally finished. We finished um Kiryu's two chapters, his back-to-back -back chapters. We got that done, we got that wrapped up. We are officially back on Goro Majima's side of the game. Um, I believe this is chapter seven. Yeah, we're on chapter seven now. So basically, um, we started off with finishing up chapter six, a uh, curious chapter. We redid the whole uh, cause. Um, we did the whole fight with Kuze. Way easier on the second time around. Um, now that I actually like had abilities unlocked, upgrades, weapons available, I was actually prepared. Who would have thought, huh? When you actually prepare for a fight, you could actually do well. What an insane concept! But we got it. We went ahead. We took his ass down. We beat him up. Uh, we got out of there. We had a nice um. A relatively nice interaction with um, what's his face, uh, um, Awano. Uh, that dude lit up, 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 lit off a bullet right in front, of, uh, right to the girl that uh, that was dancing on him. What the heck is that dude's problem? How dare you do that? You know what I'm saying? Like what the heck, bro? That was totally uncalled for. Um, they had some back and forth. Kiryu dipped out. He said, "I'm out of here. I ain't finna listen to nothing you gotta say. I don't work with people like you." Um, and then. Nishiki got his ass out of Kamurocho. They drove for hours among hours among hours practically for the entire effing day. They went to some like remote ass location in a forest. And that interaction between Nishiki Yama and Kiryu at the end of chapter 6 was insane. That was ridiculous. That was crazy. That was nuts. Phenomenal. Peak fiction, peak writing. That was incredible. 100 out of 10. I love that scene thoroughly. And then, um, basically, Kiryu took Nishikiyama's car, left him there, in the middle of nowhere, and then drove back to Kamarocho. So, only God knows where uh, what's going on with Nishikiyama, where he's walking, if he took a taxi cab, where the case may be, only, only God knows, you know what I'm saying. Kiryu definitely don't know. Um, basically cut ties. Essentially, I, I'm pretty sure that like, Kiryu essentially, like, you know, did a Sasuke to Naruto, uh, Sasuke Uchiha to Naruto Uzumaki, you know what I'm saying? I'm cutting ties with you. Um, we can't be having interactions on the daily anymore. You know what I'm saying? We ain't homies like that. Um, I gotta go on my own path, my own way. Work solo dolo. Because otherwise, your health, your safety is gonna be in danger. Um, essentially is what I kind of inter interpreted from that. So I'm expecting uh, Kiryu and Nishikiyama, Nishikiyama to not be like, you know, tight. Not to be, uh, Kiyodai's brothers, homies. I have a lot of interactions in person, one-on-one -on -one anymore. I'm thinking, unless I, uh, misinterpreted that interaction. If I did misinterpret that interaction, then please, feel free to tell me. Um, chat, please feel free to tell me if I misinterpreted that interaction, but I believe that's the case with them. I didn't review the screenshots, so take a look at it later on. Um, and currently right now, we're on Goro Majima uh, Chapter 7, where we found out the truth to Makimura. Makoto Makimura. Wait, that is her, dude, why do I always... There's too many Makotos, man. Makotos, Mikotos. We got freaking Sasuke's mom is uh, Makoto, Makoto. We got freaking Mikoto, Makoto, whatever the frick is from Persona. Like, too many too many characters have that name, bro. I keep mixing it up. Um, also, I'm playing way too many games right now. I'm playing way too many effing games. Like, um, we're streaming, we're streaming, um, Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core Reunion. We're streaming Yakuza 0. I started Unicorn Overlord Demo. Um, we got Kakarot, but that's, like, Kakarot is Dragon Ball Z. Like, that doesn't take any memory. I'm replaying through Tales of Berseria. I got God of War on Ragnarok. I'm still playing. I, I have a bunch of grinding to do on FF14. That's probably not gonna happen. So my, my brain is in shambles. My brain and my memories are in shambles. Oh, and I picked up Pokemon Legends Arceus a couple days ago. Um, on Thursday for my birthday. Which, by the way, I've done a little bit of that game so far. Um, for my Pokemon fans in the chat. I have done a little bit of Legends Arceus. I am still currently in the tutorial mode. Don't ask me how. I've been playing for over an hour. How am I still in the tutorial mode? Don't ask me. But that game is looking fire. Pokemon Legends Arceus is looking kind of dank. I'm not gonna lie. I was a little bit skeptical because it doesn't have gems, but uh, th there's some stuff there. Wait, no, no, no. Bro, her name's gotta be Makoto Makimura. Also, we're now gonna be working with God Hands over here. We're gonna be working out. We're gonna be working with God Hands over here to keep Makoto safe. Yeah, her name is Makoto. Makoto Makimura. Okay, so I didn't remember that correctly. Never mind. Okay, okay, okay. So basically, that's the deal. Um, we we gotta we gotta protect Makoto Makimura. We gotta keep her safe. We're working with the God Hands, and we need to find the ass, the the, the ass himself, the scumbag with the with the with the bat tattoo on his back, cause he needs to get put down. 
That's pretty much where we left off. So let's get it going. That's been like what a 10 minute recap. Bro, let's get let's get it moving. Let's get it moving. Um, I have been playing a decent amount of Berseria recently. I am gonna have to do a refresher on the combat. However, I'm playing as Go Goro Majima, and we finna sauce it up, baby. We finna break dance on all these goons. What do you mean? Hey, what's up, Moose? It's been a while, man. Welcome into the stream. It feels like I haven't seen you in quite the whiles. Um, because I haven't streamed since Wednesday. And usually I do on Friday. So I hope you've been well. What's going on? What you been up to? I just getting things started. You, um, it was a really heavy duty recap. But I haven't really done anything besides a heavy duty recap. Oh, hey, what's up, Hazy? Welcome into the stream. Happy weekend. Um, happy weekend to you as well. Good evening. Uh, to you, Rue. Well, um, good morning to you, Hazy. I hope you're having a nice, uh, Sunday so far, I believe. Um, oh, has your birthday passed? Yes, it was a couple days ago. Uh, happy belated birthday then. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Uh, that's very nice of you. Alright, let's get a, let's get a quick warm-up match in here. Let's do this. Yeah, see, like, dude, this, 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 this is like, this is like just GG. Like, look at this. Like, it's just so easy, dude. It's so easy with this guy. Like, look, this is just the sauce. This just doesn't stop, bro. Look at him. Look at him. GG. Already done. Bro, just get, just get out of here. Get kicked in the crotch and get out of here. Bro, I freaking love his gameplay. His gameplay in this game is by far my favorite, bro. He's just so good. Look at this guy. We guard those. <laughs> I love it so much. Um, you were busy editing a video for one of your modules. What do you What do you mean modules? Is that for school related? You were busy editing a video for one of my modules. Is that school related? I don't think you're talking about your YouTube channel, right? Um, I'm, well, I'm just passing by, sadly, because I have not slept since last night. Wait, meaning, um, you have not slept since last night, meaning you've been awake for almost 24 hours? Was busy editing a video for one of my modules. I'm assuming this is related to schoolwork. Because why would you stay up for that long to work on a YouTube video? It wouldn't make sense to me. But Hazy, please get some sleep. I feel like I said that every time. Every single time you come to the, the stream, you, you barely have enough time to just chime in. Because you're never getting rest. Make sure you get your rest. Uh, get your sleep if possible. Hopefully, well, at least hopefully it's possible. Um, try not to overwork yourself. And please take care, um, you know, of your health. Wish you all the good luck and the best with the, with the, with the finale finish to your school. Um, yeah, it's school related. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Hopefully, um, we can also get you to, like, you know, actually hang out with us for a little bit more extended time. Once you have a little bit more downtime on your hands. But yes, please, um, make sure to get your rest. And no, feel free to head out to get your sleepy sleeps or whenever you want to. Totally, totally all good. The VOD will be there. <laughs> um, so now me and Lee... Wait, what the heck? This is... Okay, all right. Um, all right. So here's the question. Do I roam around looking for sub-stories right now or do we just do main story? Oh wait, we gotta unlock Goro Majima's money-making minigame. We have to unlock Goro Majima's money-making mini minigame, his version of what Kiryu has. So maybe we should just focus on main story. You know what, let's focus on main story at least at the beginning portion of today's stream. Just until we can unlock the money-making minigame for him. Um, so that way if I want to do some off-screen grinding, I have the ability to do so. And then we will go roaming around looking for sub-stories. Because, um, let me see. What do we got? Yeah, we got... Uh, Kiryu is halfway through. Kiryu is halfway through. 30 out of 60. Goro Majima is actually just about almost halfway through as well. I do want to get those fully completed, by the way. Before we move on to Yakuza Kiwami, I do want 100% the sub-stories. Which I think I have to do more mini games, right? Like, I'm not doing enough of the mini games and that kind of content. What the heck is this? Is that supposed to be a gay bar? I said that comment just because of the colors, by the way. I'm not, I'm, I'm not trying to be hateful, you know what I mean? 
I just saw those colors and it made me think of that flaggy thing. Um, that also, that, that flaggy thing comment was not meant to disrespect either. I oh. just don't put to memory these kind of, us uh, convent the so, so, so stuff, like society, like labels and categories and definitions I don't keep track of. Um, so I, I apologize. I'm sorry. <laughs> I really... <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I haven't slept for about 12 hours. Oh my gosh, Hazy, go to sleep. Good thing is, um, after this school video submission, I have some free time to rest and do stuff. There you go, there you go. Well, you get you get that um, video submission done, get that done and dealt with, move past that and get some rest and enjoy your um, some video games, some TV shows, all that good stuff, you know what I'm saying? I'm 100% completion of uh, Wanters when Mahjong steps up to the... Uh, you gotta be kidding me, bro. 100% completion when a Mahjong steps to the sub-story plate? Oh, come on, bro. We have to play Mahjong to unlock one of the sub-stories? You gotta be serious. That god, that forsaken, that, that trash game. Um, hopefully I'll be able to join y'all fully once I'm not too busy. Uh, bro, the vid I'm supposed to churn out about my Japan loot is so long overdue. Hopefully I'll be able to turn that out soon. Oh yeah, that video, you still haven't done it. It's all good though, no rush, you know what I'm saying? That's just something for you to do for your funsies. Um, no pressure at all. Once you're able to get that done, um, I'll be looking forward to watching that, absolutely. See you all, um, have fun, Ruin Moose. Uh, take care, Hazy. Thank you for stopping by and saying hi. I appreciate it as always. And uh, please take care. Good luck with everything. I um, hope to see you soon. Preferably after you got some rest. Okay. We have have we been unlocked any abilities for this style? I don't think we have. I don't think we've really been unlocking um, abilities for him. Wait, sixty-eight million. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, since when did Goro win? What? Wait, huh? How do I have 69 million almost? I'm pretty sure we didn't unlock. We didn't unlock it. We didn't unlock the money making thing. Huh. Uh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, so we have to do Mahjong at some point, huh? Where is Mahjong in this game? Right here. Uh, I guess we give it a try. Bro, I can't believe it's already Saturday, man. I can't believe it's already Saturday. I, I, I the, dude, taking breaks from work is such a double-sided sword. Cause like while you thoroughly enjoy it, you know what I mean? It goes by way too effing quick. And now I don't have any like I don't want to go to work Monday, man. I don't I don't want to effing want to go. Yeah, I don't want to go at all. I have zero desire. If anything, I have negative desire. To be honest, the only real reason I'd want to go is because you know I need the funds for the uh, for the oh. and video games because there's some fire ass video games that are gonna be coming out. I need to make sure I can pre-order Black Myth Wukong without any sort of uh, way of uncertainty. And then we have the FS16 DLC stuff. If only there were other ways to make money, man. Oh, there probably is. I'm just, you know, not good at those things. Anyways, instead of listening to my lazy ass going on a mini rant, let's find out where they're supposed to be going. Bro, you guys interrupted me finding my freaking card. The card of the model. Yeah, she's like, y'all easy. Y'all are easy. Like, y'all have to do. I'm just gonna pose. I'm just gonna stick a pose. I got plenty of time. I ain't gonna go nowhere. Stick it. Oh, I didn't get the pose off. What the heck? Sometimes I can get the pose. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I don't have my freaking laptop charger plugged in. I almost ran out of battery and shut down the stream. Okay, we're all good. Okay, now where is my model card? Bro, we haven't watched a, a, a rated 18 video in a minute either. Wait, 
Wait, I have it equipped, right? Yeah. Oh. Wait, what the heck? <laughs> Bro, <laughs> that's hilarious. Oh my gosh, look at that face. That's 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 funny. That that was that was funny. Um, okay. Let's see. Also, by the way, um I have been reading a I have been reading a little bit of manga lately. Um like of my own um my own actual physical volumes. I read a couple Naruto chapters of Naruto volumes rather, not chapters. I read a couple of Naruto volumes and I also um, read up a Dragon Ball Z one as well. Akira uh, Toriyama, man, like that dude was cooking in some of them. Um, because I actually have never read it. I have actually never read any Dragon Ball manga. I've only like watched the anime. Because I, I like I like personally like seeing the visuals animated, the music, the OSTs, the voice acting. Which is why I usually prefer that over a manga. But I'm starting to get into manga reading a lot. I'm thinking of maybe next month of getting Goku and Goku. Like a, like the whole entire box set. I am thinking of getting Tokyo Ghoul entire box set, but I'm not sure yet. I did get a couple Yu-Gi-Oh though. That should be coming in like a couple weeks. I wanted to get at least like one, like one volume manga for Yu-Gi-Oh. Just kind of like collect like the main ones. I'm like, uh, like you know, like the uh, main mangas for series that I'm like uh, that has like nostalgia factors involved and aren't easily able to be found online without going to like shady sites when I don't have like a backup device. <laughs> Alright, let's go! Come on! Okay! Easy! Yeah! Bro, kicking him in the crotch and then the- Bro, a kick to the crotch and then an elbow to the back of the neck is such a- is that, That's so mean! Like, that is such a mean combo! Dude, the breaker style is so fire, man! What do you mean I can't play like this after Yakuza 0? Like, what do you mean actually I cannot play like this in Yakuza after Yakuza 0, dude? I absolutely freaking love his gameplay. That shit is so saucy. We haven't even unlocked any abilities yet. Imagine once we actually unlock abilities, how cool it's gonna be. I think that's what I'm guessing. Y'all are done, y'all are done, y'all are finished. Ooh, that was kind of nice. The way he kind of like paused like that and hit the pose and then kicked him. I haven't been doing anything with the other styles, huh? I haven't been doing anything with Slugger or Thug style. Mm. Oh well. Oh well, oh well. Wait, what the heck? Am I not supposed to be here? I thought I was supposed to come here. Oh, I'm supposed to go back to the warehouse. Are we going to see Makoto? Bro, I cannot believe Makoto's backstory. Makoto's backstory was insane. Like, what? Like, all of that is ridiculous. Oh, found you. You got the Riri Kuribayashi type B card. Like, how does nobody not find this place? It's not really like, it's kind of hidden, but not super. Hidden. Does God Hands already know? Oh yeah, we did tell God Hands about the way we were keeping her. Bro, she is so like, I didn't realize she was this much of a traumatized character. You say put in here? Lee san Is he alright? Where is he? He's fine. He ain't the sort of guy who dies from a bullet or two. Pin -pin mm. He's doing too well. <laughs> <So> <laughs> <Pin -pin. laughs> Thank goodness. Mm. 
Yeah, bro. Now that I know her backstory, oh my gosh, she hits her character hits kind of different. Because before I was just like, oh, she's just like a nurse blind chick. Like she's just a blind girl that works as a nurse for that for some reason people are targeting her. But now it's like, oh, oh, it's like that. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? But that means. Oh yeah. Yeah. I heard the whole story, the whole Monogatari. Uh. Speaking of which, for my Bleach fans, Thousand Year Blood War, the uh, the Blu-ray, kind of fire. I finished this one. I've got this two up to bat, and that shit, I think is totally worth it. Okay. Anyways, going on. I don't know why that came to my mind all of a sudden. You had it rough for a long time there. Mm. Hell. Well, I guess it ain't much better for you now. Stuck in an uh, uh, stuck in a old dusty warehouse with the guy who was sent here on a mission to kill you. You're stuck here with your hitman, bro. She cannot catch a break. Her life sucks. Okay, fine. So the guy with the bad tattoo isn't the one gunning for her. Who the heck is? Who the heck is gunning for her and for what reason? And do they have any relation? I see. The music right now, by the way. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, bring on the pain. Bring on the tears. Bring on the trauma. Uh-oh. Sorry to judge your bad memories. Oh, just one eye, but I was blinded too. I got locked up for a long time in a place where any day could have been my last. Oh my god, dude, this route is so fire, dude. Oh, holy crap. I, 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 okay, so I like Kiryu. Personally, I like Kiryu's character. I'm a huge fan of Kiryu's character, and I am enjoying his side of the route as well of this game. But Goro Majima's, bro, oh my god, like this, this is, this is, this is right up my alley. Like, this is the shit I love. Like, let's get it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, probably haven't compared to what you went through. I still got one a good eye too. Next to you, I'm a lucky guy. Crazy. <laughs> I mean, like, is there really a way to cheer her up given everything? I want to made you feel worse. Sometimes people just you just gotta like cry it out, man. You just gotta cry it out, or you just gotta scream it out, you gotta like break something. Oh, oh I know you hungry. Eh? Haven't eaten anything since last night, right? Right, everybody who's fine, everybody who says they're fine is actually fine. There's no way you're fine. Best thing to do when you're down is eat. <laughs> hey, he's doing his best to cheer her up, man. You gotta respect him for that. You gotta give him credit. Before he wanna give him a damn. Some takoyaki. See? I knew you were hungry. You got it. Sit tight for just a minute, okay? Okay, I can't do I can't wait to see the dynamic now. I cannot wait to see more of the dynamic between Majima and Makoto. Cause it's already taken a turn, it's already way different. In such a short amount of time span. Oof, and I thought dealing with professional women was rough. <laughs> well, let's get her some food for now. She said she wanted takoyaki. Bro, takoyaki. Oh my gosh. Takoyaki is so good. Only when it's actually made right. I got some on me. 
What do you mean we have some on you? I got some on me, but I feel bad making her eat stuff that went cold a while ago. Least I can do is go get her a hot a pack of hot fresh takoyak. Yeah, bro, what? You you, you we can't give her like old food. We gotta get her that fresh good stuff. She deserves it. Okay, I need to go put a shirt on. I wanna put a shirt on real quick, cause for whatever reason, all of a sudden it's decided to be cold in this area. When like a week ago it was hot as hell. Still, uh, um, okay. I'm back. Wait, why do I have my PS5 controller? Oh my gosh, bro. I grabbed my PS5 controller by accident. Um, I had it on my, my, my bed, uh, my bed because I was playing Berseria earlier today. And I forgot that we're streaming on the PS4. I still ain't heard from Lee. Oh, this is, this is, um. Also, by the way... Today is the final um, finale for Season 1 Solo Leveling. Today is the Season 1 finale for Solo Leveling. I cannot wait to watch it after the stream tonight. Like, later on tonight. After I go out, probably have a drink, you know what I'm saying? Come back. I'm going to watch that. I hope it's fire. They already did announce that Season 2 is going to be coming out. So it does look like Solo Leveling is actually going to be a finished adaptation. It's not going to be like a God of High School um, depression. So that's, that's pretty lit. Okay. We got a super wrestler over here. Oh, he actually stopped me. Oh, okay, okay. So you're like, okay, you're like that. Can you get up? We gotta do it the old fashioned way. Okay, for a second I thought that was gonna be a new one. That confused me a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Dang it, dude. I'm trying to do the, um, uh, grab him. Flip him. There we go. Woo dude, that, that, that heat action, I love that heat action. That is still one of my most favorite ones. Although that one we got last week, the one we unlocked last weekend with Kiryu where he, like, broke the dude's arm. Where he, like, grabbed his arm, dislocated, dislocated the sold, uh, solder. Oh my god. The one where he like grabs the arm, dislocates the shoulder, and then punches him in the bicep. Yeah, that one was crazy. Um, still ain't hurt from- Oh wait, no, no, we gotta move it. Um, okay, so where can we buy Takoyaki? We should probably make a visit to the Gandara. We haven't watched a lot of videos. So a lot of videos we have to watch. Owned by a skilled masseur. Hogushi Kaiken Massage. Wait, what? There's a massage parlor in this route? Did we go there last time? I don't think so, right? Maharaja Sotenbori. What's this? Shogi. And the Mahjong parlor, which we have to play. Oh, so we have to go all the way over there. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta go all the way over there. Alright, let's go. We'll go straight there. Um, like I said, we're gonna do relatively streamlined, um... We're gonna do relatively streamlined progress today with the main story until we unlock the money minigame. And then that's where I'm gonna slow it down and start hunting for the uh, sub stories, doing some mini games, things like that. Hey, what's up, Mars? What's good, bro? It's been a while, man. I hope you've been doing well. What's crack a lacking? How you been up? What you, how you been doing? What you been up to? Um, I'm doing pretty well. Uh, I'm doing really good, actually. Because, you know, I've been on break for the past couple days. Um, the last time I went to work was Wednesday, so I had Thursday off and Friday off. 
and now we're in the weekend, so I've been doing really good. Um, not looking forward to Monday, but other than that, I'm doing really well. How about you? How's it going? Oh, the massage parlor is Lee's place. Okay, okay. That makes sense. You know what? We break dancing. Um, played the Stellar Blade demo and reading Trigon and Hero Killer. Ah, so you're still reading Trigon? Did you finish the first one? At least? I'm assuming would have finished the first one, right? Oh, uh, which by the way, uh, my, my Bleach progress has come to a halt. I am currently, for reading Bleach, I am at, I, I paused at where, uh, the, 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 the Kenpachi vs. Uh, Ichigo fight in, um, Rescue of Rukia arc. Um, and recently I've been reading, um, Naruto, Naruto volumes and Dragon Ball Z volumes. Because I have the physicals, and so I've been reading those. Um, Naruto ones, all of the Sasuke sections, like my favorite Sasuke sections. And then Dragon Ball Z, I, I read the, uh, Frieza vs. Goku fight, and oh my god, it was so fire. So clean. Um, Toriyama's work. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, okay, so you played the Stellar Blade demo. That reminds me, I have to go back and finish that demo. That also reminds me, I got, I, I pretty much gaslit myself into streaming that. So on Wednesdays, what it looks like is gonna be the plan. Um, we're gonna wrap up and finish, uh, Unicorn Overlord demo first. So I'm thinking the Unicorn Overlord demo would be, uh, this Wednesday and probably next Wednesday. And then if I finish the Kakarot grinding by then, then that following Wednesday we'll actually do like the story, like the actual story um content where we fight against Golden Frieza, the Resurrection of F movie, or we're gonna do um Stellar Blade demo, cause uh, seeing Twitter is, is 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 annoying the shit out of me. Like seeing Twitter is annoying the crap out of me, man. Um, literally, I I I, I try not to see anything in regards to new games that I may I may stream on the channel. And so, only thing I see on Twitter is literally the Stellar Blade ass. It's just ass and, like, ladder idol animations. Like, why is there a one-minute clip on Twitter that exists of just that, that main MC chick hanging on a ladder and not even doing effing anything, bro? Just literally is staying there. Like, that frustrated me so much that I'm finna stream the demo. We're doing it. I'm streaming the demo because I need to see what the game is actually like. Um, I'm on maximum. I'm almost done. Yeah, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. The, for you to read 20 uh, chapters is, is not like me. So I had a feeling you'd be almost done. Um, how much are you having to grind for Kakarot? No, no, no. I haven't done it. I haven't done any. Um, so it's it's not that it's been like four weeks. It's, it's, it's that I haven't done the grinding. Because usually once I like, uh, once I get into the seats of to be able to play video games, I end up wanting to play like something else and I don't actually do the Kakarot grinding. So um, ever since we started the Sandlands demo, so ever since I started this new thing of streaming demos here, and we did the Sandlands and we did the, um, and we then we did the Unicorn Overlord, I basically haven't done any Kakarot grinding since our last stream. So the last time we streamed Kakarot on, on Wednesday, where I actually did grinding, that was the last time I did any kind of grinding. I haven't done any Kakarot grinding since then. So it's been about two to three weeks. So that's why. I actually have to do it. So hopefully this week or next week, I actually like commit myself to doing the Kakarot grinding. We'll have some Dragon Ball Z playing in the background, and that way we can actually get that done. Because then we have the Future Saga DLC, and then I might do the other DLCs as well. I'm not sure yet. Um... I, I, I never even saw the tweet on my on my T-list, but I do see QRTs of the clip you talked about. Yeah, dude, it's, it's the QRTs and I eventually see the original uh, original one. Um, It's literally everywhere. I don't, I don't even know why I'm the one seeing it. Like, maybe it's because of fan art. Maybe I like a lot of spicy fan art. And so, like, it's it's feeding me these, like, these, these, um, these content that I, I don't know. I don't know why I'm seeing it so much, but it's literally the only thing I see for Stellar Blade. Oh, well, except there are, like, actual, like, legit content 
people post for Stellar Blade, but I don't look at those because I don't want to see it. You know what I mean? So, whereas the other ones, it's just there. Um, the ass worked on you in reverse. Yeah, dude. Well, okay, but let's be real. Like, if, if you know, like, if that was Judith, like, let's be serious. How will I actually be reacting? You know what I'm saying? So th there's a little bit of that involved, too. It's a little bit of both. Um, because, you know, if that was her, then, um, I, will, I would still be a little bit annoyed. I'll be a lot annoyed still, but there, there's going to be certain comments I'd be making that's different than, um, than what I'm saying right now. You guys, you guys get it. You guys get it. You guys get it. I would still keep it, you know, tasteful, though. I have taste. I have class. I'm cultured. I'll keep it, you know, classy. You know what I mean? I'm not like those freaking horn dogs, bro. Some of them are so, like... Some of the posts are insane. Like, they're actually kind of crazy. I think I saw this one clip. Um... Where it was like, uh, I, it was like, I think it was like 30 seconds to a minute long or something where, uh, that main MC chick was wearing, like, apparently they designed her an outfit skin where it looks like skin. Like, I believe, um, I believe the dev created, like, an outfit that actually makes the, like, the outfit's color is matching with her skill, skin color. So it looks like she's not wearing anything. Something like that. And then there was this one video I saw where it's literally just her going up and down the ladder. Like, walk up the ladder, slide down, walk up the ladder, slide down, and that happened for, like, a, over a minute. I was just like, what the heck, bro? I thought that was kind of funny, too, but it's starting to get, like, a little bit annoying. I'm just curious how the girls feel. Like, you know what I mean? Like, um, I, I haven't really seen, like, uh... The only people I see like actually posting gameplay, talking about gameplay, or talking about the game are all dudes. I wonder like what the girls like our opinions are, because you know how some of them are like with um, how uh, uh, female characters get treated in video games and stuff, and like fan service and whatnot. Like with some of the ladies, so I'm kind of curious how they feel about Stellar Blade. I kind of am. <laughs> Bro, what is that, dude? That is so cool. How is he doing that? Uh, the ass worked on you. Oh, I already read that. It was, uh, I mean, I have no place to speak on horny MFs, and I'm worse than most of them just for different things. Yeah, 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 but like, yeah, okay, I see what you're saying. I mean, that applies to me too, then. That would also, no, no, no. It's because that applies to us is why we can speak out on it, though. You know what I mean? Like, because, because that applies to us, that's why we could call that stuff out. We're, we're not like some, um, complete outsider, I guess you could say. I don't know, but, um, because I'm definitely worse than most people in regards to certain things, but it's, it's just very, like, it's, it's, it's basically very nuanced, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. I don't know how to explain it. Um, I don't know. Though I'm probably not better if that Kubo released mini artwork. Wait, what? I'm probably not better if that, uh, if that Kubo released Nini artwork? Wait, what do you mean? Kubo released new Nini artwork? Um, the ass worked out with that. Yeah, it was too much, but the demo was fun. The demo was fun. Mm. Okay, okay. I'm probably not better since I'll act up- Oh, if Kubo releases Nini artwork. Okay, okay. I was gonna say, what? Kubo released new Nini artwork? Like, he hasn't put out any new artwork in a little while. Which honestly is fine with me. I've- I have go I, after all the news, man. After what happened with freaking um... Like, uh, the Berserk guy. Uh, with, uh, Takahashi. With, um, Akira Toriyama. And then what happened with the, um... Details of artists. I low-key don't even care if Kubo doesn't do too much now. Like if he does just, just wants to do a one-shot every year, like no actual hell arc, just a one-shot of either uh, burn the witch or uh, bleach per year, I'll be okay, dude. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll survive. Like just, just like you know what I mean. Like I'm just trying to not hear any kind of like. I just want to hear it. I don't want to hear, I don't hear that kind of thing. Typo. My keyboard is effed up. Oh no, you're all good. You're all good. No worries. I've seen some that are just as horny, but uh, some that dislike it. 
Okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. I get it, but also we just got f 16 Glide titties and no one was complaining about that. So I don't really care about them. Well, yeah, but that's not the same, bro. That's not the same. I've seen some that are just as horny, but some that dislike it. I get it, but also we just got FF16 Clive titties, and no one was complaining. Yeah, FF16 Clive tits showing is not the same as Stellar Blade. That's two different things, bro. That's two complete separate matters. At least in my opinion, I wouldn't put them in the same boat. Like, I, I wouldn't put FF16 uh, Clive um, titties showing in the same boat as Stellar Blade stuff. Like, there's levels. I would say there's levels. Hey, perfect timing. I just made a fresh bash. Get them while they're hot. I definitely think there's double standards, though. When it comes to fan service, um, whether it's male versus female fan service characters or just fan service in general between game to game, I definitely think there's a uh, like a double standard. But I would say there's also levels. I would for sure say there are levels. Um, and I and I, I would probably say like Clive's like well at least for Clive like I don't know maybe it's just because of me, maybe from my perspective because I was just like damn he's he he he's kind of like, you know. He just looks like a he look he looks like a Chad fire character design that kind of stuff. I don't really view it as like a, a like a pervy like horny way. So maybe that's why I don't really consider uh, uh Clive FF16 uh Booba showing compared to like Stellar Blade. I don't know. I don't hear much annoyance for Atelier Riza fan service, but it's not as horny as Stellar Blade from what I've seen. Atelier Riza fan that's the that's the chick with the thighs right. That the the um, Atelier Riza that's that's the girl with the thighs. If I'm not mistaken. Piping hot. Takoyaki. Give me, give me an order of that. Arigatou Make sure you eat them before they get cold. Okay, got it, uh, got the takoyaki nice and hot. Let's get it back to her before it gets cold. It's not really to the same level, but to me it's the same idea at least. Okay, so you will consider it to be the same idea. So complaining about one while loving the other means I'm probably going to take you at least a couple of Okay, I, I, I guess I can kind of see what you're saying. It's not really to the same level, but to me it's the same idea at least. So complaining about one while loving the other means I'm probably just gonna take you at least a little less serious. So like an example of that. Oh hey, what's up, Crazy Dread? It's been a while. What is up, Crazy Dread? I hope you've been doing well. Uh, there's a hidden trophy if you take too long. If I take too long doing what? There is a hidden trophy if I take too long to do what? To deliver the food? If I take too long to deliver the yak uh, takoyakis to uh, Makimura, there's a trophy for that? So like, so like, um... If I don't know, so like for example, uh, well, okay, so I do complain about, fa the only time I really complained about fan service in Trails is with Judith. So let's just put Judith uh, to the side in a vacuum. Uh, if I were to complain about fan service in general, um, and, wait, no, no, no. So let's say I did not, wait, no, I do not complain. Okay, so I don't complain about fan service in Trails, but I complain about, uh, fan service in Stellar Blade. That would be like uh, like a red flag for you then, Moose. Like something like that, for example. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I complain about... Um, if I don't complain about fan service in Trails, but I complain about it in Stellar Blade. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. That's what I was trying to say. Um, you need to wait 20, 20 minutes for Takuyaki to get cold. You need to waste 20 minutes for the Takoyaki to get cold. Wait, but then what happens if it gets cold? Like, it, besides getting a trophy, will it make anything negative happen? Waste 20 minutes? Do I want to waste 20 minutes of your guys' time, though? That's the question. If I was on my own, I'd probably go for the trophy. Um, are you talking about the waterfall scene with Judith? That's one of many things. That waterfall scene with Judith is one of many things that I will complain about. Wait. 
Wait, never mind. I thought you said complain about fan service with Judith. That, that is what I said, bro. I did say that. No, oh, but, um, where you, where we, where you got, got confused. I don't complain about fan service in trails except when it's concerning Judith, essentially. Because the other times I don't really care. When it's the other characters, I don't really care too much. Um, so the only time I complain about fan service in trail series is when it's in regards to Judith. And the waterfall scene is definitely one of them. Absolutely one of them. Among plenty. I freaking hate that scene. That scene actually visually pisses me the F off. Oh, um, nothing bad happens, you just need to buy some more. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, okay, well, I guess we can- I, I guess we can go searching for sub-stories. I guess we could go ahead and look for sub-stories real quick then, so I can get that trophy. Did Judith have fan service scenes in Crow 2? Uh, yes. Uh, she did have fan service scenes in Crow 2. Whether I would complain about them as much as Korra 1, kinda not really. Um, but there's just some stuff that's just trash. Like, there are some scenes and moments uh, for Judith in Korra 2 that's just garbage and just trash. But I wouldn't necessarily call it fan service. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess. I don't think it's crazy to dislike it, even if I personally think it's stupid to care. But when there's like a clear double standard where you dislike some but not the rest is stupid. Um, when there's a uh, when there's like a like a clear double standard where you dislike some but not the rest is stupid. Okay, okay. So basically, if you're gonna complain about fan service, you need to be complete complaining about it like in its totality, like in general. You can't just like fan service for one thing and then not like for another thing. No, I, I get what you mean. I get what you mean for sure. For sure. But also, I feel like for like for the girls side of things, I could kind of I could kind of understand because um, in general, there's a lot more um, fan service for like girl characters than guy characters. You know what I mean? Well, at least with the media that I consume, I wouldn't know like like you know because you know because I'm not like you know so I wouldn't know there's other types of media where there's more like uh, a guy character nudity and like a sexualization type of um, context. So I guess I can't really speak too much upon that. No. Something. Well, I better get going. Did the coming part already? Huh? Didn't think I'd run into you here. Wait, is this? Do we want to talk to him? Huh? There's a there's a lady chef at Com Comian. She is gorgeous, perfect for a high class traditional restaurant. She's the real dish. Is that so? <laughs> Um, we already went to there, I believe. We should have already went to Komian. We should have already gone to Komian and nothing happened, from what I remember. Oh yeah, I remember her Link event bot. Bro. You know what really pissed me off about that? People were actually gassing it up, bro. People were hyping it up, gassing it up. Talking about how I was gonna thoroughly love it, and then that happened and I was like, y'all, like, y'all really did this to me? Like, y'all set me up like this? Like, really? That made it worse. Me getting set up made it so much worse. I thought I was about to get some peak writing, bro. It was about to, like, give me some character development. I, I thought that was gonna, like, give me a tease for Kuro 3 character arc. But no, none of that. None of that. Zero. I was so upset. I was so upset. <laughs> nah, but you're good. You're good. It's all good, man. No worries. You gonna try to spoil our fun? Nah, you wouldn't do that, would you? Of course I am. Absolutely. Oh, by the way, I've been thinking. Hold on. Let me, let me get this fight in real quick and I'll tell you guys what I've been doing. I love how he just pauses. Like, he just pauses. Like, just that pause is just so cold. It's like, so nasty. There we go. Um, yeah, I get that perspective, though. 
I feel like being so deep in these kind of, of weeb and video game spaces he, uh, has also kind of shown me that men do get that same level of stuff. It's just that none of it. Oh, uh, okay. Wait. I'll, I'll wait for your next comment then. Um, I'll wait for your next comment to finish that thought. Okay, so this is what I was thinking. Um, based off the couple hours we streamed Unicorn Overlord on Wednesday, I love it. I love that game. It's fire. But, um, I, I'm thinking of leaving it on hold until, um, Black Myth will come. I am low-key thinking of not streaming, um, the actual full game for Unicorn Overlord until Black Myth Wukong comes out. Because I feel like those two would go well together. Like, Black Myth Wukong being kind of like a Souls, like, uh, in high difficulty uh, combat-wise. And then Unicorn Overlord is all automated. So I feel like those two would balance out each other as well. Well, we're, we're doing a really good time of wasting time. You said 20 minutes of um, Crazy Dread. I'm assuming once we get to 20 minutes that the uh, the trophy is just going to proc itself and I won't have to actually like, count it. Easy. Um, yeah, I do get that perspective though. I feel like being so deep in these kinds of weeb and video game spaces also has kind of shown me that men do get that same level of stuff. It's just that none of it is mainstream. You have to be going out of your way to get it. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Which I do think is valid to point out is one being okay to get out the world but not the other. Wait, which I do think is valid to point out is one being okay. Wait, wait. Which I do think is valid to point out is one being okay to get out to the world but not the other. Which I do think is valid to point out is one being okay to get out to the world, but not the other. Meaning like, meaning like questioning why it's not okay to have like the male side of things more mainstream. Is that what you mean? Um, I'll check the guide. Oh, for sure. I appreciate you. Um, if it's, if it's, uh, trouble, you don't need to at all. Um, if it's troubling, you don't need to do it at all whatsoever. But if you do decide to check out the guide, I would greatly appreciate it, of course. Um, I'm toward continuing CS3 or replaying Berseria. Replay Berseria! Because I keep seeing a certain girl in my t uh, time li uh, t uh, TL list. Are you talking about, uh, are you talking about Mar uh, oh. Margaret? Who the frick is Margaret? Are you talking about Mogilu or are you talking about Velvet? Are you talking about both? But you should replay Berseria. I vote for replay Berseria. If you're taking votes, I vote for that one. But I think oh. men getting that same level should be normalized instead of restricting things. Right, right. It's not really my kind of thing. Like, it's not really my thing. Like, I personally wouldn't enjoy that type of content. But in regards to it just being accessible, I definitely think that is the case. Um, although I guess it would need to be done by, like, a female developer, a female writer or whatever. Or, like, a dude that's gay, per se. I don't know. I feel like it's a little bit like a... It's like a... a I'm not say political. Is political the way I word I want to use? Controversial the word I want to use? Hot water, the word I want to use. I don't know what word I'm looking for. I am not, I'm not sure what exact word I'm looking for with that statement I just made. But hopefully you guys understand what I was trying to say. Um, okay, guide says it's 15 minutes, but should pop then. Okay, okay, okay. Velvet? Yeah, you should do it. You should do it for Velvet. But I love Mogilu. Okay, okay. You should do it for Velvet. For Velvet Crowd. Absolutely. Bro, there's no sub stories. Bro, where are the sub stories, bro? I didn't replay a bit of Berseria last year, but stopped in the beginning where you work for the shadow. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I haven't got to that part yet. I am currently working on trying to get towards Logan. I usually, um, I usually replay Berseria every other year. Roughly about every other year is when I replay Berseria.
Have you finished the friendship quest in Kobian? I don't think so. But there was no way for me to talk to in Kobian. I went there and there was no one for me to speak with, so I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing there. Woo! Bro, dude, where's my heat action? Oh my... Hello, my grab? Bro, what the heck is going on? Bro, what the frick was that? Um... I love the dub for Berseria, especially oh, Velvet and Magalu's voice. Oh, okay, okay. Um, I haven't really actually, I haven't actually heard the dub voice, because, you know, I, I, I freaking, dude, I, uh, Rina, um, Rina Sato, I think that's how I say her name, is the one who voices Velvet. Um, I really like her, which is one of my favorite ones. So, um, I actually haven't really heard Berseria dub too often, too much. But, um, uh, if you enjoy that, hey, that's, I love to hear that, I love to hear that. Um, either way, dub, sub, doesn't matter. As long as I, as long as you enjoy Berseria, that's what matters the most. Um, kind of nice seeing Ru and Moose give a deep talk about fan service. It's as deep a talk as it's going to get, probably. <laughs> I don't think, um, I don't think it, um, yeah, that's actually, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that is pretty much, um, as deep as of a talk in regards to fan service we've ever had. Part. What did it even get triggered by again? Oh yeah, I got triggered by freaking um Stellar Blade. That's right, I forgot. It got triggered by Stellar Blade. I remember now. I usually I usually don't have talks too much about deep sort of things like that, especially because sometimes things I'm not the best with wording things. And when I'm um, when I'm on live, like I, I have to give my thoughts on the spot, just off the rip, off the fly. Um, so I usually try to walk on eggshells because I don't want to say anything that could like you know bite me in the ass but um they're, they're always fun they're sometimes fun to have every now and then talking about like that quote-unquote dicey things or at least things i'm not uh i'm not comfortable with uh addressing on twitter uh you need to eat there are few times to unlock oh you have to eat there got it got it got it yeah i haven't eaten there okay so let's go ahead and go over there then let's go to komian Speaking of dubs, Yakuza actually gets dubs for the newer games. Yeah, but apparently everybody just complains about them, right? Like, I believe the newer, the newest most games are the ones that have um, English dub for Yakuza, but doesn't everybody just complain about it? Uh, you got the Riri Kuribayashi type C card. Let's go ahead and hit it. I really want to play Stellar Blade to hear the voicing, by the way. One of the me one of the reasons why I really look forward to Stellar Blade is because I want to hear the Korean voicing. Um, I've never played a Korean game before, because uh, I don't know where I would get a Korean game and I wouldn't know what Korean game to buy. So I really look forward to being able to play Stellar Blade one day, because literally just for the Korean voice acting, I want to see what that all, all the different voices sound like, especially for the MC, because she's gorgeous. The MC is beautiful. And who she was modeled after is beautiful. So I want to hear like who the voice actor is. And thankfully, Stellar Blade has Korean voicing. Oh, there we go. Best served cold. We got the trophy. Oh, there's Komian. Let's stop by here real quick. I heard a few, uh, I heard a few clips. It's decent, but it feels a bit strange with photorealistic characters. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean it feels strange with photorealistic characters? Uh, it's a bit weird hearing the English dub for some uh, for some of the OG crowd. Oh, uh, because it's like, because they got used to the sub, is that why? 
like the beginning Yakuza games are all in um, Japanese voicing, so like it's it's like a like a hard switch, like kind of like a. Okay, okay, I, I kind of get what you mean there, Crazy Dread. But the VAs to hire are very good. Mmm, gotcha, gotcha. Um, no, the dubs are actually really good. It really is just the one guy who's bad, but he managed to get the role for the MC. Oh, I see. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, because the main complaints I see are in regards to the MC, I believe. As opposed to overall. Hey, there is one guy who's a bit of a meme. I think that's the guy that Moose is talking about. There is one guy who's a bit of a meme. I'm assuming that's the guy that Moose was talking about there, the MC dude, the one who voices the MC in English at least. Um, I think I've seen like some of the some of the some of him. Like I think I've seen him in, on Twitter a few times because <laughs> uh, people were trolling him a little bit too much. Uh, welcome, sir. Will you dine with us today? Yeah, let's dine. Let's eat. Let's eat a couple times and then we'll go buy some hot chocolate. Yes, I can't believe we wasted 15 minutes. That was like nothing. That was so easy. Like I didn't even try to waste any time. It was just natural. Um, snow crab. Twenty-five thousand for snow crab. Oh, we have eaten here before. I had to go to marbled wagyu. That's right. We have eaten here once. Let's just go for something cheap. Let's go for the sashimi platter. Oh, there's the friendship meter. And then we unlock the sub story for Komi and Chef. There we go. This is our half. This is our 20th one. Um, we're not going to do this right now. I'm just going to act. Actually, you know what? Should I do this right now? Yeah, let's do this right now. We'll go ahead and we'll go ahead and finish this off, I guess. Um, depending on what the con the contents of this sub story is before we can try to get more hot Tokayaki. I mean, some voices don't match for certain characters after playing Japanese for so long. Also, I'm reminded of old but badly dubbed Hong Kong movies in dub. Also, I'm reminded of old badly dubbed Hong Kong movies in dub. Wait, why? Why specifically dubbed um Hong Kong movies? That's kind of random. Um, also for me, like, I I would definitely play them in Japanese voicing. Besides the fact that you know I usually always go the JP route anyways, but just because like when it comes to mafia, like Japanese mafia, like yakuza, I I I, I need to have that JP voicing. Like for me, it just is just does something um what's the food to your liking yeah definitely thanks by the way did someone recommend a restaurant to you mm -hmm. nah i was just passing by and thought i'd try it haha <laughs> now nah, that's a surprise Wait, what do you mean that's a surprise huh what's so strange about that yeah what's so strange about that it's just that we don't often get young customers like you sir the young generation is all about quick food craze no at least that's what they see on tv you mean fast food? I indulge sometimes. Didn't know it was some big fad. Young people always want to try new things. And this fast food is so trendy nowadays. My son and all his college friends only eat at fast food places. Not proper restaurants like this one. But you didn't come here to listen to an old... Uh, an old... And, uh, but you didn't come here to listen to an old man complain. Wait, What? There's a side quest tracker? Wait, there's a side quest tracker? And, and nobody told me about this until now? Bro, this side quest unlocks the side quest tracker as a prize? Oh, we're doing this now. We're doing this immediately. I won't bore, I won't bore you with that anymore. Do you mind if I ask your name? I'm Majima. Goro Majima. Oh, well, Majima-san. I hope you come back to visit us again. This could be the beginning of a friendship with Komi and Chef. Interacting with him will gradually fill the friendship gauge. You can check out the status of his game. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, well, I'll be back. Yeah, like right now. I need seconds. I'm hungry. I'm kind of fat. I have, I have, I'm depressed. I have bad eating. I have a bad eating um, habits. I need to, I need, I need to order another meal. Is it the same thing? Do I have to come here multiple times or can I just order multiple dishes? Ordering most multiple dishes at once would be more efficient. Can I just do that? Like what happens if I get soup of the day? Wait, what the heck? Oh, are you serious? He actually can't eat? Bruh. 
It actually locks me out of eating because he's too full. Bro. <laughs> I didn't expect that. I didn't I thought I could just eat again. I actually have to wait for him to digest the food. That's hilarious. Well, in that case, let's go buy us some hot takoyaki. Let us go buy some hot takoyaki. Um I grew up watching old Hong Kong martial arts films. Uh, and my uncles would buy a duck poppy where they were badly synced or didn't even try. Like drunken master, fist of fury, etc. Okay, now I understand. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Come in multiple times. Yeah, I, yeah. You need to exit and reload each time. You can only eat if you've taken some damage. Oh, it's not it's not a certain amount of time. I have to take damage. Oh, okay, okay. Well, if I do the whole takoyaki thing, I don't think I'm gonna lose that. So let's just go ahead and do this. I don't think I took damage there. I don't remember. I do not remember. So let's just go ahead and move um, and get the takoyaki. Uh -huh. There is a CP skill that I believe gets rid of that restriction. Or you can buy medicine that damages you so you can keep eating. Wait, you could get a medicine that actually does damage to you? What? The longer you take, the longer Nishiki is stuck in the woods. <laughs> I guess he's gonna have to sleep. I guess he's gonna have to sleep out in the woods because that man is gonna be waiting. You can buy medicine that does damage to you. Bro, I was trying to get inside. Batter up! Poor Nishiki got eaten by bears by now. Nah, he has, he has a gun, right? Or did um did his gun get confiscated by um Kirioso? If if, it, if that's true, then that's just the crazy. Sajima can do it, so can Nishiki. And I'm pretty sure Kiryu can fight bears too. Wait, Sajima? For Persona 5? Wait, are you talking about Sajima from Persona 5? All Nishiki has to do is draw a circle. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Talk about how he needs to draw a circle. Okay, that was hilarious. You can buy medicine that does damage to you. Oh, Abstim? Is that what this is for? 
Um, Abstim RX stimulates the appetite by improving digestive tract function. Oh, this is what this is for. I remember seeing this and being like, this is useless. No, this is actually has some use. Okay, we don't have any, we don't have any, like, dude, I don't have any, like, I don't have, actually, you know what, let me just grab one. Let me grab one for now. Let me go ahead and take this. Oh my gosh, bro, the amount of HP damage that it does, what the heck, bro? Don't worry about it. Uh, Sajima is a character in a later game. Oh, Sajima is a character in Yakuza. Is it a guy or a girl? I'm not going to ask any more questions besides that. I just would like to know if it's a guy or a girl. Okay. So let's go ahead and buy some more food. Bro, give me this side quest tracker. Abstim is way handier in future games. Got it, got it, got it. So it does a lot more for you in future games. Okay, okay, interesting. But it's got its uses. Apparently it's got its uses. Wait, I didn't mean to do this. I didn't mean to do this. Oh my gosh. In Yakuza 2, it's OP as heck. Okay, so it does like other um, other bonuses and stuff like that. Okay, interesting. Um, let's just go ahead and do this. Go ahead and do that. What is this? This UFO part is an extremely rare artifact. It is said to have dropped from a ship that appeared in the sky and is worth a lot. So do we get to sell this for a lot of money? So for this UFO part, do I just sell this for money? Uh, Sajima is a young boy. Oh, it's a boy. Sajima, Sajima is a young boy that fights bears in the wilderness. Okay. Wait, what? Think of that kindergartner that Majima beat up? Oh, you mean the future boss? You mean that one kid that's uh, going to become like an actual, like uh, a main problem and a boss later on when he grows up in one of the future games? Is that what you meant? Is that the guy you're talking about? That kid? Yep, sell it at Ebisu. Okay, okay. We'll sell it later. We will sell it later. What's happening in my inventory? I do. Where is Ebisu? Oh, Ebisu is over here. Actually, it's like literally on this on this line. Uh, 15 minutes has have to have uh, passed by now. It feels like so long. Oh, we already got the trophy, bro. Um, I, I already got that 15 minute trophy. It has absolutely been past 15 minutes. <laughs> oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. I kind of got sidetracked by the sub story at uh, the freaking restaurant because I want to get that side quest tracker. Oops. I'm really good at stalling. I am a little bit too good at stalling, unfortunately.
fire. He got the trophy already. We're doing a side quest now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. LOL. Yeah, yeah. Me and uh, me and like not making progress is just, just, just. It's just so easy to like get sidetracked and not like make progress in the game. Like, I don't know how people finish games so fast, dude. Like, Rebirth, we're screwed. When we eventually get to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, like, we ain't making no progress, bro. Oh, Majima-san, welcome. What do I have today? Let us try the Matsutake set. Nanchu Asia. How was the food? It was great, thanks. I'm happy to hear that. Please, come again. We hope you will dine with us again, sir. This is a Yakuza game. Side quests are the main game. Well then, perfect. That is perfect for moi. Okay, so now let's go ahead and do this. And then what? I just go right back inside? Is this gonna work? Or do I have to give more time? Or like, do I have to lose more HP? No, I can just automatically just eat. Yeah, it doesn't look like the more expensive food actually gives you more friendship points. It looks like it doesn't matter what you eat. So I'm just gonna go with the cheapest one. I think we'll just go with the cheapest one, yeah? Unless you have to do one of each entry and that's what really gives you the friendship points. I don't think that's how it works though. I think you just have to eat anything. Well, we gotta go back. We have to go back to the drugstore. We have to go back to the drugstore. I don't got time for you right now. Get out of my way. It makes sense that the libido guy is waiting outside the drugstore now. Get them enhancement pills. Give me like, give me like three of these. Okay. Eat everything on the menu once to get some points for the shrine. Oh, is that points for? Okay, okay, that's points for the shrine. Got it, got it, got it. Damn, dude, some of those food are so expensive. Did that cost like twenty five, like twenty five thousand? For what reason? Let's get hit a couple times. Bro, are you guys not gonna hit me? Oh my gosh, their damage is so awful. I'm gaining HP. How am I gaining HP? Do I have an ability? Do I have an ability where I gain HP like over time? Like what the heck? Like he was auto regening. That was crazy. Top this light looks like garbage. Looks like something we absolutely do not need. Maybe I just did that and I got away with needing to use one of those um stimulants. Do you have the hawk armor equipped? Hawk armor? Hawk armor? I don't think I even own the hawk armor. Do I own the Hark armor? I don't think so. 
I don't think I have outside. anything like that. I gotta check. That was about fifteen thousand is right off the drain. Oh. Yep, this is heaven. <laughs> There's no reason for me to repeat any of this dialogue because none of it has literally changed. Are you talking about this? Oh, that's why I'm healing. It makes you more patient so you can recover health while standing still. Oh. I forgot I had that. Oh, that. Okay, now I understand. Now that I understand. What is this? Why take it off? Why not leave it on? Is it a problem to have it on? I feel like that's good, right? Like, that seems useful to me. In a fight. Stand still, get some HP back. A little bit. Although we're on a one-on-one -on -one zone. In a one-on-one -on -one fight when you're getting mobbed up, I guess is. You don't shame us, eh? Almost there, boys and girls. Almost there. Oh, okay. We have new dialogue. Hmm. Oh, I'm so sorry. Pay more attention to what you're doing. You're embarrassing us in front of a customer. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll be more careful. But you have to be so mean. Don't worry about it. But are you okay? Didn't get hurt, did you? No problem. Yeah, okay, okay. It's not a problem then. It's actually really strong. Yeah, that's what I thought. It seemed really strong. Um, so I'm gonna leave it on for now. We'll leave it on for now. No, I'm fine. Thank you for your concern, sir. <sighs> Come on, get it together. Please don't be so nice to her, Majima-san. If you spoil them, they get out of hand. Uh, that's so? See, I didn't know you had another cook working here. Oh, she's not a cook? She's just kitchen help? Doing the dishes mostly. That's definitely what's healing you though. Yeah, it definitely now that I looked at the description, that's definitely what's giving me that heal. I thought maybe I did like an upgrade as like a passive skill, but no, it's purely equipment wise. Which now makes sense. She doesn't have proper training to do the cooking. Well, I'm sure she can learn, especially if she's working under your guiding touch. Yeah. She doesn't have what it takes to create traditional Japanese cuisine. It's a tough job, Majima-san. If you say so. Well, thanks for the food. I gotta get going. Please, come again. She seems nice. Use it again. Go back inside. I, I, it's, it's so funny that there's an item literally that allows you to do this. <laughs> uh, what do we have left? Only the snow crap. And that's everything. <laughs> Complete comain. Do I have to do that for every restaurant? Do we have to eat every item at every restaurant? Will that give me a CP if I do that for all locations? Maybe I should do that for Kiryu's route also. Hmm, that was some good stuff. Huh? What the hell were you thinking? Huh? What's that about? Oh, I'm sorry. Go men aside. Go men aside. Go men aside. <sighs> I didn't want the leftover ingredients to go to waste. So you cook them? 
This is a high-end restaurant. We don't serve leftovers to customers. Besides, you are just kitchen help. I never gave you permission to cook anything. Come on, no reason to get steamed at her. Oh, Majima-san, I'm so sorry for making a scene in front of you. I forgot myself in anger. It's all good. But now I'm kind of dying to know what your assistant's cooking is like. Mind if I try the dish she made? <laughs> eh, nani? Yeah, that's for all restaurants. Oh, uh, okay. So from now on, do not buy the same food item a second time. Always get all the items, even if it's expensive. Got it. Understand. Does that apply for bars and alcohol? You can get an item for alcohol too, for drinking all the booze. That answers my question. You can get an item for alcohol too, for drinking all the booze. I see. <sighs> I don't know, Majima-san. It's not properly made. Well, now that I understand, we'll absolutely be doing that from now on. I'll make sure to go to the restaurants and buy every single item off of it. Not right now, though. Not right now. Like, I'm not going to, like, grind it all, like, now. You know what I mean? Like, we don't need to do all of that. Why not? I'll even pay for it. No, 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 no. I couldn't take your money for that. <sighs> well, all right, then. If you insist. But it's an exception, and please don't tell anyone else about it. <laughs> no problem. I ain't no gossip. I'm tight-lipped. Um, how was it? Pretty good, actually. Maybe the flavor isn't as robust or consistent as what's usually served here. But still, it's pretty impressive. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm so happy you liked it. You dummy. He's just being nice to you. That's all. Don't get silly ideas in your head. Bro, why are you so mean? Why are you such an ass? Yeah. No, I, I meant it. I'd even pay cold cash for this at a regular restaurant. <sighs> what's your name? I, um, I'm Nozomi. Wait. Isn't there somebody else in this game, Nozomi? Nozomi-chan? Wait, didn't she used to make- didn't she make videos? Isn't there a Nozomi we watch videos for? We are not on a first name basis with customers here, uh, idiots. Use your last name. Oh, I'm so sorry. Come on, give her a break. Ain't nothing wrong with a nice, friendly feel. Nozomi-chan, keep it up, and you'll make a great chef one day. Me, a chef? Um, I'll try my best. Majima-san, you're spoiling my staff. <laughs> I gotta go, but I'll be back soon. Well, we'll be looking forward to that. Um, goodbye. Didn't we watch a video for Nozomi? Maybe that was Kiryu's route? I can't remember. You can get more food in one trip by picking up- Oh, what's this? You can get more food in one trip by picking things that heal less HP first. Oh, that makes sense. So if I use the uh, that stimulant item to do more damage to myself, then I could do- Oh, I see how it works. I see how it works. Okay, okay, okay. All the video girls, um, all the video girls turn up in game if you know where to look. Well then, we got some quote-unquote research to do. What did I do? What do I do, rather? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. You on your own today, Nozomi-chan? Majima-san, wha what am I supposed to do? Uh -huh. I, I, what? <laughs> hey, what's wrong? Pull yourself together. What happened? Nani? The chef was in a car accident? Is he alright? I don't know. I got a phone call from the hospital, but they didn't say much. Only that he won't be able to come into work. That's worrying. And to make things worse, we have a reservation today. I don't know if I should cancel it. It's for today? Hi. It's for a regular customer? He'll be here soon? Well, with the chef not here, you can't do much about it, can you? But canceling this reservation could cause problems too. Why is that? It's one of our best customers. He's been coming here since the restaurant first opened. And today, he's bringing an important client for a business dinner. If we close the restaurant, it may have very bad consequences for him. 
Maybe so, but who's gonna cook for him? Uh, I could do it. I thought you weren't supposed to do that. You sure you want to chance that? The head chef will be furious with me if I do. He may even fire me. But I've got to try because he might fire me if I don't do something. <laughs> it's damned if I do, damned if I don't. <laughs> I see. She got she got caught in a rock between a hard rock and a hard place. Bro, did I say that correctly? Well, good luck, Nozomi-chan. <laughs> Thank you, Majima-san. I've got to hurry. The head chef was out buying fresh ingredients when the accident happened. We're out of stock on most things. Let me guess, I'm finna be your delivery boy. That ain't good. And I don't even have time to go shopping. Well, guess who does? Me. I gotta start cooking now. She's in a tough spot. Maybe I'll help out a little. Yep, what did I say? Tell me what you need. I'll go buy it for you. You'll get the ingredients for me? That's so kind of you. Well, what do you need? Fresh salmon, whole, and a soft shell turtle. A soft shell turtle? Fresh salmon whole and a soft shell turtle. Eel as well. If I have that, I can make something good. What are you gonna make with salmon and soft shell turtle? Um, why is the kitchen hand ha uh why is the kitchen handling reservations instead of the reception lady? Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that. That comp I was just reading it and that completely slipped over my mind. <laughs> why is the kitchen why is the kitchen freaking um the uh the dishwasher kitchen hand lady handling the reservations instead of the reception lady? That's so true. Oh my gosh, how did that not how did I not think of that? That's hilarious. Oh my gosh, that is so funny. You need to go fishing to get the ingredients? Oh come on man. Oh come on man. I have to go fishing for a soft shell turtle? Hi. Do people do people actually eat turtle? People actually eat turtle, bro? Where do they even sell those? Might even might be easier to go fishing. Well, there you have it. There you have it. Why is the freaking dishwashing lady who keeps dropping dishes the one responsible for handling reservations? That's so funny. That is so funny. Well, it's time to go fishing. It is time to go fishing. Bro, what happens if I don't like catch the specific thing that I need? I have no bait right now. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, people deep fry crickets? I mean, that I know. I know about that. Turtles eat the round blob shapes? Wait, what? Wait, what do you mean? Turtles eat the round blob shapes? What? Turtles are the round blob shapes. Oh, 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 I see what you're saying. Dude, this is like, oh my gosh. Can something bite my rod? Or bite my, um, what is that called? What is the end of the fishing rod called? What is that? Needle, bite the needle. I don't know what that thing is called. Bite the lure, I guess. Can we get something, please? Oh my goodness. Maybe I need to buy better equipment. Is there a way to buy better fishing equipment? Dude, can I get a nibble? Nib anything? Anything at all? Oh, there it is! What the heck, bro?
Wait, how did that not work? Wait, what the heck did I do wrong? <clears throat> hook? That makes more sense. It's called the hook. What what the heck happened? Like, did I not do that? Do did I did, did I do it too late? Did I have slow timing? Like, what the heck, man? And now we gotta sit here. You can buy a better rod at Ebisu, but you don't need. Are you sure? Are you sure we don't need a better rod? Because this is taking thousands of years. I don't get it. What is happening? And now all the fishies are gone. You need to wait for the red part of the lure to be on the waterline. I finally guessed something and it's an effing purse. Dude, come on. Might be able to get a better one at the pawn shop. I don't know. I found a platinum plate. You're kidding me. You're actually kidding me. <laughs> at least I understand how to fish. I think we need to get some more bait, dude. I think we need bait. I think we need bait because, like, the, the the odds of me actually, like, getting in the first try is not that high. Let's try going to the other side directly. Aim about one foot to the right of a shadow. That's kind of what I was trying to do, but I have terrible aim. That's what I was actually trying to do, but I guess I was just aiming wrong. Oh, is that the only place we could fish? So are all the fishing goods at Ebisu? Is there no like fishing store? There's no fishing store for me to go to. They're all just at Ebisu. Is that how this works? This isn't a fishing spot? Bro, how is this not a fishing spot? You're telling me there's only one fishing spot? Oh, here we go. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Okay, don't press it yet. You gotta be patient. Gotta be patient. Now! Yeah! Yeah! Yes. We got a koi. That's not a salmon. There's a place to fish on both banks. I found the second place. I found the second place, but that's a koi. That's not no salmon. So now I gotta find a salmon. Bro, we gotta fish for these? Like, why can't I just buy this at a store, dude? They're forcing me to do that fishing. There's a place to fish on both the banks. Bait swaps common fish for rare ones. But as all the fish you need are common fish, bait are actually... Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. So what I need is considered to be common fish. So if I use a bait, it's gonna make it harder than it is already. And we wouldn't want that, now would we? Can you please bite the hook? Bite the hook. Bite it. Nibble. Put your mouth on it. Oh my goodness. There you go. There you go. You're right there. Just, just, just.
Come on, come on, come on. Another purse, bro. Another one. 10,000 yen. I mean, I'll take that. The rods increase your range, which isn't useful unless you are sea fishing. Oh, you can actually go sea fishing. Okay. So really, it's okay. So you really don't actually need to then. Oh, that was fast. Come on. Yes. We got us ourselves a salmon. We got ourselves a salmon. A salmon. Perfect. Now we just need an eel. You don't look like an eel. I think that that very first shadow I saw, that looked like an eel. So unfortunately, I think we took an L there. How am I supposed to find a soft shell turtle? Oh, come on, please. I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Another bag. You're effing kidding me. One million yen, bro? Give me that money. Give me that money. I'm not going to complain about getting money like that. Hell no. Hell no. You need them for 100%, but that's it. 100% meaning like to get all the trophies 100% because I'm not necessarily trying to 100% this game um, I'm definitely not trying to 100% Yakuza 0 and like get like the full trophy uh, trophy achievements I just want to do 100% in terms of uh, doing 100% of the sub stories is basically what I mean for 100% of the game just getting all the sub stories done that's all turtles are on the south bank eels on the north South the bank? Okay, okay. So turtle should be here then. Is what you're saying. And the opposite side is where the eel should be. Come on. Take a bite. Take a bite, please. Maybe I should refresh it. Maybe I should try it again. Nothing's happening. Maybe I should retry. So what have you guys, um, you, uh, Crazy Dread and Moose, what have you two been, um, playing or watching? If you happen to watch anime, um, Crazy Dread. Okay. Dude, what is going on? Bro? Why do I keep getting the bags? Yeah, dude, 100% is insane. There's no way. 100% is wild. Like, actually fully doing every single trophy achievement 100% in the game sounds absolutely ludicrous to me. But sub stories are challenging, but it's not like undoable. I feel like that's the most realistic. Trying to do all of the sub stories, I feel like is the most realistic for us. If we were to do 100% of the game, we would never get to play the other Kiwami games. Oh, we got a crayfish. Wasn't there a shadow here? Am I tripping? The last one took it pretty much immediately. Maybe I have to go directly on it. Oh, it's moving. I watched some One Piece, but that's about it these days. Uh, I see, I see. Um, are you like, uh, like an OG One Piece fan? I mean, like, you kept, you've been, um, 
like you've been watching it uh, from the very beginning of it or are you just getting into it now and like you're just watching that only I'm assuming you've been like a fan from like the beginning I finished the new story patch at HSR oh nice you finally finished that story patch you were talking about it was fire mm, nice glad to hear that um, but I'm glad to be done so I can get back to the other stuff wait why is it I, but it was I thought you said it was fire though you said it was fire but you, you want to just like get past it it was fire, but I'm glad to be done so I can get back to the other stuff. Are the stories in HSR like tedious? Are they time consuming? Been watching Monogatari 2. I'm on the last arc of Bakemono. Damn, you're already on the last arc of Bakemonogatari. I still haven't watched it, dude. I need to get back. I need to get back to watching more ba 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 Bakemono. Like actually giving it a, the shot that it deserves. Because <laughs> I did enjoy that first episode. And then that one just takes it immediately. Interesting. Can you please be something good? Okay, so you're just gonna give me the crayfish all day. You are just giving me the crayfish all day then. Perfect. I started reading in Drum Island. Still never forgiven Oda for making Nami-chan sick. Oh. <laughs> I actually haven't um I haven't consumed One Piece at all myself. I do eventually someday want to give it a chance um when I have like uh time for it. Well, I could probably make time for it, but it's just cuz like if I were to, I would have to stop consuming all other media. So I haven't given it that up that that like um that commitment. So hopefully one day I do get to One Piece. So I'm not really sure what the reference is for there. But yeah, we're not forgiving Oda for making Nami-chan sick. How dare he? No, I mean other games. Oh! I'm glad to be done so I can get back to other stuff. Ah, I see what you mean. I thought you meant get back to other stuff in HSR. I misunderstood. Um, I still have so much to get through. Unicorn Overlord, for example. I'm in the last area. I gotta finish that. Oh, you haven't finished Unicorn Overlord yet. I see, I see. Oh, hello. Need me to run any errands for you? How about a little something to fill your stomach? After all you did for me, it's my treat. Nah, I'm straight. I forgot about Errand Kun. I can't believe his name is Errand Kun. Basically, just Errand Boy is his name. They just take out the D at the end. Okay, so we're still out. We're still short a tortoise. We're, 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 we're short a turtle part and we're short an eel. We're one out of three. Let's try it. Okay, we got an eel. That's gotta be an eel. Has to be. Has to be. Come on. If that's not an eel, I'm going to be so upset, bro. Oh my god. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Stop. Stop. It has to be an eel. Right. We're never gonna get this, man. Stop. 
wrong a bank for eels, even though they're blob shapes? Right. When you say blob shapes, do you mean this? Is this what you mean by blob shape? These little small things? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, we got the turtle. We got the soft shell turtle. So the eel's on the other side. Monogatari, I did kind of stall because I got to the arc with my favorite character finally and was forced to rem remember that that arc is kind of mid. Mono God 3, I did kind of stall because I got to the arc with my favorite character. Finally. Uh, your favorite character is that one girl you were talking about, right? The shy girl, I believe. I forgot who it was. I believe it's like some sort of young, short, shy girl character. I can't remember who you said your favorite character was or how you described her, unfortunately. Um, but maybe I'll be able to guess once I actually watch more. But you were forced to remember that that arc is kind of mid. I see. And by arc, you're just referring to two episodes, if I remember correctly. So you're just saying like those particular two episodes in Bakemono is mid. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so now we gotta go to the other side. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. So basically, I was supposed like when we were getting those um when I go, we was getting like the scorpion looking fish. That was essentially what I was supposed to be doing to try to get the eel. I just didn't get the I just didn't get the pull. Okay, okay, but I was on the right track. Uh, so let's go back then. Let's go back. Let's go back. Should be here somewhere, right? All right, this is it. We're going to get it right now. We are going to get this right here, right now. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Come here, eel. <laughs> you know you want to get eaten. <laughs> All right, show me that eel, baby. Nope, it's another freaking scorpion. Try this. <laughs> Oh, come on. Oh, what the heck, dude? Are you... What the heck, bro? Stop. Stop. Watch this be another bag. It's gonna be another purse bag. Oh, my God. Right. No, where are you going? <laughs> These small blobs are annoying, dude. Yeah, that two episode stretch eventually leads into my favorite arc in the entire series. Ah, interesting, interesting. It has best girl, so I cut it some slack, but compared to others, it's not that great. Okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. Interesting. Very interesting. Dude, can you just effing bite the hook, bro? Man. 
Are you sure I'm supposed to be going for the blob shape? The blob shape is just constantly this crayfish crab lobster looking thing. Why are you why are you going away? Why are you going away? Come back here. Yeah, there you go. Come back. Come back. Come back. Perfect. Come back. Come back. There you go. There you go. Come to daddy. It's a little bit further. Bro, you're literally right there. What do you mean you're not going to do the red signal? Oh my gosh. Eel are long and thin. Okay, so what I thought was the eel for the other side should be the eel for this side is what you're saying. Let's try here. <laughs> so what I thought was the eel for the other side of the bank should apply to this side. Blobs were for turtles. Oh, when you made that comment, I thought you meant both. When you made that comment, I thought you were referring to both of them. This should be it then, this should be it. You guys were swatching me freaking do the like great fish this entire time and didn't see anything, man. I'm out of space. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I accidentally pressed the X. We got everything we need. Let's get out of here. Let's first make a stop at the drugstore. Actually, no. First, we need to make a stop to where we, like, store our items. Finally, bro. How long did we spend fishing, dude? Like, what the heck? Salmon are medium-sized fish that swim around a lot. Not that you need one, because I already have one. But that's what they look like. GG. Yeah, finally GG, dude. Oh my goodness. I should have known it was the long thin one, but I just, I um, I misunderstood and I thought it, you meant blobs for both sides. Okay, let's go ahead and buy us some of the, uh, About 20 minutes, not bad RNG. That wasn't that bad RNG. If it took any longer than how long it took us, I would have lost my mind. I usually don't enjoy fishing minigames. That's probably why, though. I typically don't enjoy fishing minigames. It's very rare that I do. Okay, let's go ahead and let's wrap up the sub story. So we can get this item. We're doing this for the sub story search item. Because that would save us a lot of time in the long run. What the heck? Was this always here? Was that statue always there? Because I don't remember seeing that. We'll help that guy out later on. We're fine. He'll be okay. He'll make it out of there alive. I'm sure it'll be just fine. Oh, you're back. Did you manage to get all the ingredients? I got them all. The salmon, soft sauce turtle, and the eel. Should I give them to her? Yeah, no, we're going to keep it. But what am I going to do with these? You handed over one salmon, one soft shell turtle, and an eel. <laughs> That's everything I needed? Oh, thank you. That's everything I need. Oh, I already read that. You gonna have enough time to prepare the food? I... I'm not sure. It's almost time for the reservation. You mean they're already here? Hi, boss. We're a little early. Hope that's not a problem. Yeah, that's a huge problem. It's a big problem. You guys came early. Like, are you kidding me? They're already short on time, but you came early. Yeah, usually you can probably get your unpaid workers to do it for you. I get it. I get it. No, 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 just take out the unpaid and then you can leave the rest of the statement. 
Ah! They're here already! Is that you volunteering, Moose? If so, you're for hire. Whoa, are you okay, Nozomi-chan? Oh, she's perfectly fine. Why don't you gentlemen have a seat? Uh, alright. You okay, Nozomi-chan? What needs to be done first? Um, let me think. Let me think. Need to cut all the ingredients first, and then... Then I need to season the Majima-san. I need to season the Majima-san. Yeah, you want to season him up? You want to season... You want to season up his body? I don't know if I could do it. Oh, so they spelled season like the month. Is that how seasoning is supposed to be spelled? Actually, yeah, I think it is. Calm down, Nozomi-chan. Take a deep breath and don't season me. <laughs> Pour salt all over his body. Do it. What should I do? There's no time. <sighs> well, I think the first thing you should do is not panic. Yeah, ain't got uh, gonna get any uh, anything done if you panic. It's okay, I'll help you. You'll help me with the cooking? You can cook, Majima-san? <laughs> I can do the simple things. Chopping, slicing. Well, he knows how to slice it up, all right. Taking orders and carrying stuff, that'll free you up to do the rest, yeah? Hi. Hi. Whoa, I'm so full now. Thank you, Nozumi-chan. I noticed that the food tasted a little different today. Hi. Yes. Is the boss not in today? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Actually... Seriously? He's been in an accident? Is he okay? <sighs> I don't know yet. Jeez, poor guy. I hope he's fine. So you've been on your own today? I guess that's why the food was different? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. You must have been terribly disappointed. It's nowhere as good as the owner's cooking. Well, to be honest, the difference was pretty obvious. I I'm so, so, so sorry. Go menacei, go menacei. Oh, don't be. It wasn't bad at all. Huh? Are? The boss can do what he does only because of decades of hard work and experience. You can't duplicate that. Exactly. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't call them unpaid. They're blanks. Oh my god. They're, they're the S word. My bad, bro. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. You know what? One day I'm, I'm gonna take um, I'm gonna have a take your homies to to your work one day, and then you're gonna see what my conditions are really like. You'll be wishing you you I was your boss, but you did everything you could to make sure we had a good meal when you were all on your own. I could tell you really put your heart into it. You put together a wonderful hearty meal. I tasted great. Really? I didn't know what to expect, but the food was great. And with a lovely lady like you working here, this restaurant is a real winner. I'll have to come again. In that case, why don't we have our business dinners here in the future? Perfect. I'll be looking forward to it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, he's back. Oh, here's the boss. Are you all right? Aren't you hurt? Psh, I'm fine. Did you think falling under a car would kill me? Yeah, who would have thought, huh? Why would falling Why would falling under a car kill anybody? What a crazy idea. You're not getting rid of me so easily. But then why are you so late? <sighs> they made me go for a checkup at a hospital. Took ages. Told them I didn't even have a scratch on me, but they wouldn't let me go. What a pain. <laughs> Whew, I'm so relieved. But now I think I'm um, about to pop a vein. When did I give you permission to serve food to customers? Uh-oh. <sighs> I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't have done it. Boss, don't be so hard on her. She did great. Listen. Bro, did you just eat their food? That's so that's so nasty. I don't, I'm sorry, but that's kind of nasty. Hey, <laughs> you still got a lot to learn. But you did good. Huh? You took good care of the restaurant while I was gone? Boss! But this isn't anywhere near good enough to serve to customers yet. I promise not to do it. Uh, I promise not to ever do that again. I'll go back to doing the dishes. Don't interrupt me. I didn't finish. I'm trying to tell you I'm going to make sure you learn how to cook properly. Are? It's my fault for not training you right. I didn't think you had it in you to become a good restaurant cook, but I was wrong. 
You proved that wanting to make sure the customer is happy is the most important thing. <laughs> Thank you, boss. Thank you so much. That's a W. I won't go easy on you, kid. You'll regret you signed up for it. I can't wait to get started. Majima-san, you have my thanks. I understand you went out of your way to help to save the day. Please take this for your troubles. Oh, I went through a lot of trouble, by the way. You got a trouble finder? He's thanking me for my troubles by giving me a trouble finder. <laughs> he is thanking me for helping him with his troubles by giving me a finder to find other troubles. Nozomi-chan did all the hard work. You should thank her, not me. I mean, I did the fishing. Um, Nozomi? Hi. Yes, boss? I'm going to drill everything I know about cooking into your head. It'll be hell, believe me. The tabayo. I'm looking forward to it. Someone's too embarrassed to say what they mean. <laughs> this device is set to help find people around town who are in need of help. Bro. This is the side quest one? Hold on. Wow, we actually don't have any sub stories. At least ones that aren't props. We have to like proc them. Um, we're gonna take a short pause, y'all. I'm gonna take a really quick pause here, maybe like like a minute or so, like a couple minutes. I'm gonna grab some water and I'm gonna be right back. Thank you all for coming through. Um, Moose, Crazy Dread, anybody else that's lurking in the stream or watching this about? Thank you guys so much for the support as always. I hope you guys are enjoying. Um, I'm going to grab some water real quick. I'll come right back. And then we're going to go for at least another hour or so. So hope you guys look forward to it. Hopefully we can make a little bit more progress with the actual story. And then, um, yeah, be right back.
Thank you guys for waiting. I appreciate it. All right. So let's go ahead and let's finally buy this freaking taco yaki. Let's do it. Two hours later and we still haven't... Basically, right. almost two hours later, we still haven't delivered um, Nozomi. Uh, not Nozomi. Talk about Nozomi. Almost two hours later, and we still haven't delivered freaking uh, Makoto Makimura her freaking takoyaki. She's probably still waiting. Bro, what is going on? Oh my gosh, that was crazy. Okay, so once it once it get into the flow, it's it's pretty much no issues. I don't know. I took a little bit longer because my throat was hurting. I don't know why. I don't know what's wrong with me. What's going on? But my throat hurt a little bit, um, so I took a little bit more extra break. Yeah. Oh, all of a sudden now we have something. What is this? Okay, this is bad. Now that I have the trouble finder and I can find all the sub stories, we're never gonna make progress. Now this is bad. This is not. Good. You got the Rina Ito type A card. That's a cute little outfit. Dude, I know, right? We actually kept a blind girl, uh, no, actually traumatized. We kept a traumatized blind girl locked up hungry in a warehouse while we went fishing. <laughs> I am a, I'm a class A role model, exactly. I'm a good Samaritan. Wait, so what is the, what is the freaking, where is the, where is the sub story here? Is it you? Maybe it's you. Hello, sir. Can I get you anything? I'm gonna try a similar tactic. Let's try a similar tactic as the restaurant. I think so, huh? The friendship meter just went up. Usually when there's a friendship meter, that means there's a sub story involved. This is one of Japan's top single malt whiskeys. It's become such a status symbol that whiskey aficionados the world over have heard of it. You need to drink booze for the side quest. Well, there we go. There we go. We gotta drink booze. They use carefully selected, perfectly matured malts to get that great smooth flavor. Lee questions if he made the right call leaving Makoto to Majima now. But he don't really got another option now, do he? Does he have any other options is the actual question. You seem like you can hold your liquor well, sir. Is that so? Yeah. I've been doing this for a while, so I can tell uh, by the way you drink. Are you well versed in various liquors, sir? <laughs> I wouldn't embarrass myself trying to show off to an expert like you. I'd gladly listen to some interesting trivia uh, liquor uh, from you, though. <laughs> I'll be happy to share some of what I know. Just like people, liquors have their own character and each is unique. Understanding the subtle differences may help you appreciate them better. <laughs> well, I'll be looking forward to coming here again and again to listen to your Laker Tales. Laker Tales, Laker Tales, Laker Tales. Gotta go for now. Hi. So in order for me to drink more, do I still have to use that, that freaking um, medicine? I don't think so, right? I should just be able to drink. Because drinking doesn't involve, like, stomach. Drinking does not involve stomach. So I'm thinking we should be good. Get you. Let's get you. Oh, you can only order one. I see. Let's just get the cheaper ones out of the way then. This is one of Japan's top brandy. This bestseller has won over countless people with its bright, fruity aroma and smooth taste. As for the name, BSOP stands for Very Superior Old Pale. Hello, sir. 
If we if we if we get too drunk, does he like? Is there like a throw up animation? This is another extremely popular Japanese whiskey. Spirits aged in sherry barrels at the Yamazaki Distillery are blended with carefully selected malts and grains. This yields a bright aroma and a sweet fullness in the mouth. And the finish is deep and mellow. A lot of people call it Dharma because the bottle's round shape looks like a Dharma doll. Look at all this liquor trivia that we're getting. So educational. Such important information we have to know. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Maybe I should stop. That's at the red zone. Okay, is it the red zone? Does this work the same way as with the food? No, but if you max out the drink meter, it messes up your controls. I maxed out the drink meter, so let's play darts. I have maxed out the drink meter, so it is time to play some darts. Let's go. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Makoto. Makoto Makimura, you're gonna have to wait some more. You're gonna have to finna wait some more. I apologize. Let's do it. I forgot how to play this game, by the way. You need to buy some legendary drinker to drink more. Okay, legendary drinker is what I need. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> mess up my controls. Oh my gosh, that blurriness is messing with my head. Oh my goodness. I picked the hardest difficulty, didn't I? Yeah, I picked the hardest difficulty. And you got a higher score than me? Shoot. Right there. Yeah, there we go. Right here. Yeah, there we go. There we go, baby. There. Who's nice drunk? Not me. Couldn't be me. Could not be me. Match that one, bozo. What you got? Ah, you suck. Maybe I should have chose something lower than one nine ten, probably, huh? <laughs> Perfect. Nice dog. It's so easy. Do ya? Although, how I'm going to get exactly to zero, that's the question. Getting it to exactly zero is going to be a little bit troublesome. I'm not doing too bad. In IRL, I, I in IRL the only thing, only kind of bar game I've ever been good at is darts, actually. Because poker, pool, all the kind of stuff I suck. I'm terrible. Especially pool. Bill, bill, billiards, whatever the other name of it is, I cannot play that to save my life. Like actually. That's not what I meant to do. 
I didn't mean to do that. Damn. Doria. 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 Okay. Did I get it? I don't think I did. Did I get that? I don't think I got it, huh? Did I miss? That missed the circle? Yeah, I sh I, my bad, guys. I should have picked like a lower starting number instead of 9, 10. A little bit too high. <laughs> Terrible. Absolutely horrendous. <laughs> Even worse. Oh my gosh, I can't see anything. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, he's gonna do that. <laughs> we got this, Goro. <laughs> yeah, we got this, Goro. <laughs> I didn't get it. I didn't get it. I didn't nice get it. Nice I didn't get it. This is gonna be a lot closer than what it was supposed to be. I don't think um I don't think drinking would really show in karaoke, huh? Like I don't think drinking would show any side effects in karaoke at all. <laughs> oh, that's dead in the center, I believe. Actually get oh you get CP for stuff like that? Oh you got I got a CP for doing that. Interesting. Okay, so we need to get 59. Yeah we got the W. Yeah, I think darts. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We got the W. Nice, that's nice, nice. That wasn't that bad at all. Sweet. I hope you enjoyed the game. By the way, is this your first time in our bar? Yeah. Do I try something new for a change? <laughs> I see. Let me give you these. They're slightly better than the run of the mill house darts, and I can keep them. But of course, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Can I drink more now? I'm still in red zone. Let's get into a fight. Let's get into a fight fight. I want to see how that looks like. GG. Thank you, Crazy Dread. I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. We have another sub story. Bro, we're getting sub stories galore. Sub stories galore. I should take this off. I, I, should, ta I should take it off. I, I really should take it off. We're never making progress like this now. We're never going to do nothing. We are never doing anything now. Another sub story, bro. Okay, it doesn't look like it affects the combat. It does not look like drinking affects the combat at all. Yeah, okay, so it doesn't really did that, that, that didn't feel different whatsoever. Oh, 
You need to get these stories done at some point. Might as well be some do some now. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much exactly. Bro, what the heck? Where is it? Bro, what the heck? Where is the card? Oh, there it is. You got the I Haneda Type C card? In my opinion, you want to do them as early as you can. Because free gear is better than the sooner you get it. Yeah, like that, the, the, like the fine. Yeah, right, right, right. Because if you get it post game, it's kind of like, what's the point? Are you the sub story? Yes, I was there. Maybe you a sub story? <laughs> you know the ashtrays? Yeah, I, it took me forever to finally find that. Thank you, Crazy Dread. Um, you need to play Space Harrier. I need to play Space Harrier. Space Harrier. Okay. I would have never guessed. Thank you for that, because I would not have taken a guess. Alright, we haven't played this one yet, I believe. I don't think we have. Shoot is circle, square is reverse switch, rapid fire. Huh? Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get oh no, we have played this. Yeah, I believe we have. I remember this now. Or maybe we play like a different variation of this game on um, my, uh, on Kiryu's route. Oh my gosh, they actually fire. Oh, what the heck? Get ready. Ah, suckers! Eat my laser! Dude, what is that? It's not doing anything. Is that a dragon? Bro, what the heck? It's literally doing nothing. There we go. Second stage. Giza? What type of name, bro? Oh! Okay, that is creepy. I love how I have unlimited ammo. I have absolute unlimited ammo. Feels great. My goodness. Ah! 
I think you said something in the chat, Crazy Jim Buzz making attention. Stage three. Can I pause? Um, enter any high score and you should be fine. Okay, okay, okay. Unpause. No! Get ready. Wait, when do I die? Die. Do I have three lives? Is that why? And we're dead. Bro, I almost got the top Get score. Ready. Wait, we're still alive? Wait, when does this stop? I've already died three times, but we haven't we haven't like what the heck is going on? I'm a little bit confused. Usually when you die three times you lose. Three strikes and you're out. We're still going. Um, what's happening? Why isn't this ending? How do you end this? We already got the top score, so I want to end this. There we go, finally. Let's get out of here. Get out of here. How do I get out? Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. How do I get out? These retro games are designed to eight quarters. Yeah, so you would think um you would think that you would die you would die after three times. These retro games are designed to eight quarters. So you you would think that only three lives and you die, so that we get to pay it again. You know what I mean? How do I get out of here? Welcome to the mm. fantasy zone. Get ready. Uh. Bro, how do I leave? Oh, the amount of lives is in the bottom left corner. I didn't even see that until now. Dude, can someone kill me? Can somebody kill me? Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Crazy Dread. <laughs> Thank you for that. Thank you for that. Otherwise, I would have been stuck trying to figure it out. Excuse me, I couldn't help noticing that big grin on your face when you were playing. I was grinning? Really? Hi, you look just like a cute little kid having the time of your life. It was adorable. I almost went over and gave you a big hug. I mean, you know. I couldn't concentrate on the game if you did that. Ain't really the time for it. Oh, too bad. Still, I guess it wouldn't be quite appropriate for the staff to do that to customers. It's okay, no worries. It's all good. Same goes for anyone, lady. So is this game really that much fun? Yeah, it's a little on the hard side, but it really gets the bulla plumping. No kidding. Maybe I'll give it a try myself sometime. Why don't you? I'll teach you. You play a lot of games? Well, I work here, so I think I play more than most people. Yeah? Maybe you'll be blowing away the high score soon. Do you think so? I might try it out and see. I'll let you know if I get a score worth mentioning. <laughs> All right, looking forward to it. Can I ask your name? Uh. Sure, it's Majima. Majima-san? My name's Kyoko. Uh, Kyoko. Ki Kyoko. Yeah, Kyoko. Nice to meet you. Uh. Yeah, likewise. Uh, interacting with her will gradually fill the friendship gaze. Okay, so I just talked to her? I literally just talked to her? How is this man still buzzed? <laughs> Hi Majima-san, I hope you're enjoying yourself. Bro, what the heck dude? I thought I have to... <laughs> Do I literally have to play this every time? I have to pay a hundred yen just to talk to a lady. It's... <laughs> So I have I have to like actually like fully play this. 
Or maybe, maybe I could just do this and then exit. Maybe I don't have to actually do a, like an actual like play. No, I actually have to play the game. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we actually have to play though. Like, we legit have to like play, play it. I can't just like proc it and then dip. Can I skip this? How many times do I have to see this? Let me skip that animation, please, for the love of. You need to enter a score. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Perfect. Get ready. Come on, something hit me. Perfect. We need to die three more times. Get Two ready. more times, actually. Wait, what the heck? That didn't kill me? Perfect. And then we Get have one ready. more time. Perfect. Okay. Get ready. Wait, what? Okay, now we should be good. Boy, you must sure like this game, Majima-san. Yep, I can still do better. I can feel it. <laughs> I think I'll be able to get a good score soon. Just you wait and see. Looking forward to it. Okay, let's play it again. We just gotta keep doing this back and forth. Mickey Mouse. And we gotta, we actually have to like, oh my goodness. Oh, look who's sitting over there. Huh, that looks like Kyoko-chan over there. She's in the middle of a game, so I better not disturb her. I'll wait till she's done. Looks like she's done. Hey. Oh, Majima-san, you came at the perfect time. Why? I played a few games while I was doing some maintenance and I got a pretty good score. See? Give me a look. A million points? We're not doing this again, bro. We're not doing this again. That's pretty damn good for someone who just started. <laughs> I thought so too. <laughs> yeah, you're a natural. Say, Majima-san, how about we have a little competition? Nani, you and me? Hi. If you get a better score than me in your next game, I'll give you a prize. A prize, huh? So, what do you what do you say? Take on the challenge. All right, I'll take you on, bro. We're not beating a thousand million. We're not beating a million points, bro. I have to beat her. You have to win. You can't lose. You must win. Great, bro. Fantastic. I have to win. It's a hundred percent winning. Oh my god. Well, who's ready for this L? Who's ready to catch an L? What was the highest score I got last time? 300,000? I'm supposed to get a million? Bro, it's not happening. Welcome to the fantasy. Get ready. Welcome to the fantasy. Get ready. I gotta concentrate. We can't afford to lose any life until we get to like stage two or three. Wow. 
What the heck? Get ready. No, I'm choking. Oh, that was Get three ready. million what I got earlier. Oh, I thought that was I thought that was three hundred thousand. Cause I wasn't really watching it carefully. Yeah, I, I misread it. I misread it. This is a lot easier than the cars. This is so much easier than the cars. Bro, beating the freaking, um, what was the electronics king in that car game? That was impossible. Like, what? This I could do. I've actually already beaten it. Should I just die? I think I should just die. Just to get it moving. Let's die. Let's die. I can't. I, I didn't. I yeah, didn't think. Friend. Yeah, it's already done. I didn't. I didn't realize. I thought I was at like three hundred thousand. That's why I was tripping. Okay. We're good. Get ready. Let's get out of here. Dude, yeah, I the car the car one's way harder. Okay, okay, so it's not just me. That car one was way too hard. There was no way I didn't get it done. I didn't get done that car one. I just ended up moving on because it was it was freaking impossible, man. This this is extremely doable for me. All right, how about that? Wow, that's incredible, Sugoi Sugoi. You're really good at this, Majima-san. <laughs> that's right, baby. I can't believe you breezed past my score like that. I really tried my best in everything. Well, you know, I came out top today, but I'm not sure. I'm sure you could do better if you kept trying. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you're much kinder than you look, Majima-san. Oh, I almost forgot. Here's your prize. Quality iron. Uh. Yeah, let's see how high a uh, score you could get. Okay. Alright. Go back. Man, Makoto is like, dude, what is going on with this guy? Like, where is he? You're out here playing video games with another girl and leaving me here in the warehouse cold and hungry? <laughs> yes, I know how to play this game. I've been playing it multiple times already. You don't gotta tell me every time I open it up. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Give me the ability to enter coins. Come on, give me the options button. Where's my options button? Why does it, dude? Can you? Okay, there we go. Welcome yeah, yeah, yeah. Score doesn't matter against Robert. He's gonna ready. die. Dude, what is going on? Wait, my control changed. Wait, what the heck happened to my controls? Get ready. Wait, why is going up down? Get ready. Wait, hold on. There we go, that's better. Okay. Get ready. Dang it, I messed up. Perfect. Get ready. Oh, we're not dead yet, that's right. Now we are. Beautiful. Thankfully, the score doesn't matter. If they made the score matter, then that would have made this so much worse, man. If you press square, it inverts the control. Oh, I see. That's what happened there. I was like, what? 
That was so confusing. Bro, how do you play with inverted controls? My brain cannot handle that. Oh, Majima-san tapping away like usual, I see. Yep, gotta get my score up. <laughs> I'm close to beating my personal best, too. I'll let you know how it goes. Uh. Okay, we only need to do this one more time, probably. We probably only need to do this once more, and we should get the max out here. Um, I'm guessing what? I have to beat 2 million, probably? I'm thinking the next score I have to beat is 2 mil. I'm assuming. Oh. Are? That looks like Kyoko-chan over there. She's in the middle of a game, so I better not disturb her. I'll wait till she's done. I was pl uh, just playing a bit while I did some maintenance, and I got a nice score, see? Uh -huh. Yeah, let's see. Whoa, yeah, that's 2 million points. Yeah, how did I guess? It's an 80s game. It was common back then. Mm, okay, right, 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 right. <laughs> I do I do got to keep remembering that. Pretty good, huh? I memorized all the obstacles and practiced a lot, so my score shot up. <laughs> yeah, playing a ton's the best way to get good at a game. <laughs> Not really. So do you think you can keep up with me? I play a lot of games and I'm, I still suck. That your way of calling me out? What do you say? Would you like to try and beat my score? I do have to get 3 million. So I actually have to get 3 million this time instead of just like randomly getting it. We're going to do this again. I'm pretty confident I'll take the win this time. If I lose, I'll do something really special for you. Yeah, you're going to do something really special for me? Is that right? Well, I'll be damned. Well, I will be damned. They're playing the, the song, bro. The song that they're playing right now, bro. If you beat my score, I'll bring out my fantasy zone. Your fantasy zone? Ooh la la. What have we got over here, chat? What do we have over here, chat? You're going to bring out your zone, you say? You're going to give me a special prize? Okay, girl. All right. I see you. Your fantasy zone? Uh, what's um, what kind of zone exactly are we talking about here? Oh, that's the secrets. You will only find out if you could beat me, but I just know you're gonna be hooked once you try it. Mm. I've been wanting to show it to you for a while, Majima-san. You'll love it, I promise. <laughs> I love it. This is great. She mean what I think she does? Fantasy. What do all men fantasize? I love it, the sound effects. I love it, fantastic. Zone. Is something wrong, Majima-san? Are you a little bit distracted, bro? Are you sure you're gonna be able to get this W, dude? Ah! Oh, I think I've been spending too much time with Mr. Libido, man. No, no, nothing. I ain't thinking um anything un untoward. Huh? <laughs> anyway, are you ready to compete against my score of 2 million points? I know that's not what she's talking about, but I think it's hilarious either way. <laughs> Although I definitely could see how that might get old quick, but for right now, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, time to get this two milli. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Try to lock in. Just knowing me, I might choke. Although we have four lives, four lives is a lot of lives. And for the most part, all, all of the times we died was because I was trying to die. Oh wait, what? You didn't you didn't get shot? Get ready. This is what I'm saying, bro. I'm finna lose.
Oh my gosh, you stupid dragon. Wait, no! Get ready. Oh my gosh, bro. Are you serious? Get ready. What did I say? What did I say? This happens every time, bro. I choked. Are you kidding me? I feel like I should have got to do. Why did I take so? I feel like this is taking longer than usual to get to the two million, though. Welcome to the fantasy zone. Get ready. Cause last time I got that part, I got way higher than two million points. Maybe I didn't destroy enough of the background. Maybe I gotta go for more background here. Okay. Second time's the charm, baby. Second time's the charm. No fantasy for Majima, no fantasy zone for Majima. Feels bad, man. Okay, there we go. How did that not get destroyed? I was literally blasting it point blank. We gotta do it for the fantasy zone. We gotta do it for the fantasy zone, Majima. Come on, stay focused, bro. I 
I think we did it. Yeah, we did it. We did it. Perfect. 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 Get ready. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Get ready. There we go. Uh, just came back. Why are you staying so low to the ground? Oh, welcome back into the stream, Moose. Um, I hope everything's okay over there. Just came back. Why are you staying so low to the ground? There's a lot less stuff to dodge in the air. Oh, it's because I've been going up and down. I've kind of been going up and down all over the place, so that's why. And also because I thought if I destroy it, I would get more points than just dodging. But yeah, we got the GG's. Woo! We got the GG's. Think, thankfully, it did not take, like, the amount of tries against the freaking, um, Electronics King with the car one. That one, we didn't end up getting, and I tried for more than too long. This one, get in, get out. Very nice. Thank you, chat. I appreciate it. Get a load of this. Wow, you did it. You're so good at this game. <laughs> I am messing around when I play this one. So, about that zone, you said that you're going to prize me up. What's up with that, girl? Can I get, uh, can I, um... Can we, uh, maybe you should take us to a private place? Oh, well, I guess I lose. How will I ever beat a score that high? It's all about per uh, perseverance. Stick with it. Video games are a lot like sports. The key is to keep practicing and not set limits for yourself. You really are much kinder than you look. Well, I'll keep trying then. See you around, Majima son. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What about the fantasy zone thing? Oh, it completely slipped my mind. I'm sorry. She teasing me or something? Well. <laughs> the side effects send me, bro. The side effects send me in this game. Well, I can't do it right now. I have preparations to make, you see. Can you come back later? I see. That ass angle. Oh, uh, yeah, makes sense. Okay, see you later. Oh, I can't wait to see the look on your face. Bye for now. I think points is just on how long you can go, but doesn't matter now. Oh, got it, got it, got it. Yeah, it doesn't, literally doesn't matter anymore. Literally does not matter anymore. Let's go back. Kyokotron was saying she was going to show me her fantasy zone, but I wonder if she's ready. Majima-san, thank you for waiting. Hey, tonight we're going to... Uh... Just for you, Majima-san, I got the manager to install these. Oh, Fantasy Zone is a literal game. <laughs> it's the latest game, Fantasy Zone. That's hilarious. Oh, I thought you'd be more excited. No, he was waiting for something else to get excited for. Something that would have made him stand up. I went to a lot of trouble for this, you know. Oh, no, sorry. It just caught me off guard. Yeah, it looks fun. <laughs> yes, it does, doesn't it? It was a big decision to put these in, so if and nobody plays them, it'll leave us in a squeeze. Get as many games in as you can. Uh, yeah. Of course. Fantasy Zone, huh? Yeah, woo! Sounds epic! Woo, uh, woo! Fantasy Zone, let's go! <laughs> uh, that's called karma. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I'm coming. This is hilarious, by the way. I thought this was so funny. Well, you play as long as you want, Majima-san. Don't go setting yourself any limits. He's so upset. I love it. Not exactly the kind of fantasy I had in mind. It's so sick, man. It's so rad. You can now play Fantasy Zone.
Oh, is that it? I guess that's it. You also like oh Kyoka has a naughty video. Interesting. Kyoka. So there is a fantasy zone. Well, it's not gonna be showing, but it's still a naughty video. Alright, that one's done. We have this one to do now. Bro, today ended up being sub stories galore. Today ended up just being sub stories all about sub stories. Oops. How do I get this on Kiryu's side? How can I get this tracker on Kiryu's route? I kind of need it. It makes uh, it makes looking for him a lot simpler. We've already been streaming for three hours, bro. What the heck, dude? We have already been streaming for three hours today. I'm all um I am all about whatever that smell is. I want in on that. Talk to her again once the business unlocks. What business unlock? What are you talking about? Place is pretty popular, ain't it? <clears throat> Must mean it's good stuff. Hey, excuse me. What is that sweater you're wearing? Whoa! Did she seriously just cut in line? That ain't right. Oh. Hey, lady, no cuts. Get in line like a normal person. Oh. Huh? You weren't even in the line. Come on, lady. You get your eyes checked lately? I was standing in line right here. I got one more eye than you, Sonny. If, if anyone ain't seen things straight, it's you. Nah. What a stubborn old hag. Hey, come on. Can't you take this elsewhere? I'm trying to run a business here. <laughs> See, you went and got us scolded. How embarrassing. If you weren't trying to cut, this never would have happened. Oh, so scary. Scary man. This old brat's a real pain. What's my move here? The, the real fantasy zone was the PRN we watched along the way. <laughs> uh, Kiryu gets it after defeating the Electronics King. A quest unlocks for the tax lady. Wait, when you say defeat the Electronics King, Kiryu gets it after defeating the Electronics King. Do you mean we have to beat him in a video game or in a fight? Or like get all of his shares? Move her aside. She ain't gonna see reason. Better just relocate her. Ah. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Well, you cut in line and then you refuse to move, so I'm moving you. Perverts! This purse trying to grope me. You could grope ah. you. I wouldn't touch you with the cattle prod. Help me! He's a pervert! Hold on now. Stop making a damn scene. Mama, what's a pervert? Uh oh. <laughs> Don't point, Hero Kun. You don't want anything to do with this horrible man? Yeah. Hey, that ain't true. Hirokun, your mama's got the wrong idea. <sighs> nah, treacherous old dingbats. Wait, what the? Oh. Hey, where do you think you're going? Man, I'd drop it if I were you. She's a pretty infamous uh, up, uh, Obatarian in these parts. Obatarian? Obatarian what? The hell is that? You ever heard an old lady called Obasan? Well, she's like that, multiplied by a tank battalion. Hence, Obatarian. Uh, a battle axe has never been as sharp or as deadly as her. Mm, I see. You need to get 90% of the area and win a fight. Okay, that's perfect. That's fine. A battle axe? She's just an old lady with terrible taste when you get right down to it. <laughs> Says you, trust me, you don't want to get involved. Underestimate the Osakan, Obatarian, at your own peril. The Obatarian, huh? You get yours next, lady. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and let's deliver the hot takoyaki. Let us finally actually deliver the takoyaki, shall we? You can lose the car racing. It's not a big deal to, do, to lose those challenges. Okay, perfect. That's what I was worried about. That basically what, what was what I was worried about. But if I don't have to worry, that's even better. That is even better. We should also probably grab a drink, huh? Yeah. <laughs> 
いらっしゃいませ。ありがとうございました。Oh, it actually says cold takoyaki. Nice. You can get 10% back in two or three collections, and that's less time than winning the race, even if you do it first time. Yeah, I wasted so much time. Like, I think we did what, like three or four tries for that car racing? That was such a waste of time, man. Such a waste of time, though. <laughs> Not, for us not having unlocked the money mechanic, we actually have a lot of money. We have over 80 million. Maybe I should make some upgrades here. But we haven't we haven't got to a fight on Majima's route that I struggled with. Let's just get a quick save in, just in case. Um we're probably gonna talk to uh we'll talk to Makoto Makimura. We will give her her food, and then we'll probably kind of see from there. I'll uh, probably go for like, what, another 15 minutes or so? Probably. Save completed. the 80s money's easy to get no no no. i meant not not really like in curious route we took us a long time to get this kind of money that's what i meant that's what i meant but also i haven't really been spending at all like i haven't spent it on upgrades yet i'm still going the wrong way No, but what I was meaning is um, I was comparing to Curious Route because on Curious Route we didn't really have this kind of money until we unlocked this money making mechanic. Yeah. Yeah. I got some smoking hot takoyaki. Hopefully it'll help calm her down a little. Oh. Got that snack for you. Takoyaki. Thank you. Have you calmed down a little? Yeah. But now I'm hungry. <laughs> That's good. People are machines and food's fuel. Nah, I'm getting hungry, I'm not gonna lie. Ano. Huh? Anata wa. Me. Doshtano. What happened to your eye? Sono. Well. Katamega. You said you lost vision in one of your eyes? 
I was curious how it happened. It was an injury. Almost more of an accident. Totally destroyed. What do you mean an accident? No, I still got one. And it does more than enough. It, does, it handled. It takes care of the job. It take it take care of the job. Oh my god. Poor thing. Huh? Are you daft? I'm a lot better off than you. But mine is caused by emotional trauma. Mine is caused by emotional trauma. There's a chance I can recover. That's what Lee San said. Mm. But yours is just destroyed and gone, gone. So you still got a uh, hope then? That's great. Isn't that good? But yours? Your eye is? I'm used to it now. Don't slow me down any. Ruin my handsome face. So you're a handsome? You're a handsome man? Crying shame I can't show ya? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> there it is. Nice to hear that laugh on its way back. Okay, okay, Majima. Wait, you wear a wristwatch? Eh? Oh, yes. Ain't that a little odd for a blind girl? I suppose. But it's cute, isn't it? That's my whole point. How would you even know? Seriously, sheesh. This one plays a little music box chime. It sounds so cute, it always makes me smile. Bro, she is so freaking like, oh my gosh, bro. It doesn't play anymore? The watch is broken? Are you kidding me? Some things you just can't throw away, you know. Even some things you just can't throw away. Even if it seems pointless to other people, some things are just really important to you. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. The dialogue right now between these two. I lost my sight. All track of time. The watch broke. The chime stopped playing. I have no need for it now. It's a memento of back when my life was still normal. If I got rid of it, I feel like I'd never. Oh. The music right now. The music right now, guys. Oh my gosh. I get it. Huh? If you can't bring us to the throat away, keep it. Hang on to it long enough. Eventually, bring you good luck. The piano, though. Oh my god. Hmm? What's wrong? You're right, it's silly. It's because I keep clinging on to stuff like this that I can't face reality. It's fine, thank you. You are very kind, I appreciate that. That ain't right. If you still need it, then you should just keep it. You still need it, it's fine. I need to get stronger. I will get stronger. I have to. Mm. He kept the watch. Your boy Lee says he's got something he's got to look into on his end. I'll have him come straight here to get you once he's done. So just sit tight until then. Mm. 
知らない。ドゥズノヘム。ああ、ダンブ、ミスター Tojo clan. Nothing you need to worry about. So then, what happens if you keep letting me live? Will that Yakuza come and kill you? Hmm. I'll be fine. Old man Lee has got a plan. Both of us will come out of this alive. The guy's your boss, right? Have a little faith. I'll be back when work is over. Okay, you good? Don't trip and fall now. Bro, that interaction was amazing. I love that scene. That scene was great. Hmm, maybe I'll drop by a, a cabaret club like Yamagata Han suggested on my way to check in on the Grand. I might have seen one in the Hoganji Yokocho area. Maybe it's worth a check. I first want to go, but I want to go back to the bar first. Yeah, I want to go to the shop bar. Oh, oh, let's get some alcohol and then let's go ahead and do the um that one with the um the Obasan. The sub story with the Obasan. Perfect timing too, because they almost caught up to me because I was being stupid. Wait, what the heck? What is that guy doing here? Okay. Let's do that. This is the standard of the Makalan line, aged entirely in sherry barrels. It's perfect for those looking to enjoy the mak Makalan without breaking the bank. It may be the standard of the line, but it's guaranteed to deliver the makalan taste. I urge you to experience its sweet, full flavor and bouquet for yourself. <laughs> You've been visiting often recently, so if you'd like, your next drink is on the house. You don't mind? Not at all. <laughs> it is a good whiskey. It's 18 year old Yamazaki aged in cherry casks. Sh uh, cherry casks, eh? That sounds pretty tasty. Hi. Hi. There are casks that were first used for aging sherry. The wood soaks up some of it in the process. Then they are used to age whiskey. It becomes infused with the subtle sherry aroma and takes on a unique tinge. <laughs> you make it sound so enticing. I bet even someone who doesn't normally drink whiskey would be tempted. Bet accepted. <laughs> but that means you'll have to bring your friends here to test your theory. <laughs> so you, the free drink was just a clever way to make me bring you more customers, eh? You are quite perceptive. <laughs> 
Uh, well, thanks for the uh, Yamazaki and Sherry Cask trivia. I'll be back sometime to learn some yeah. more. My pleasure. I'll be waiting. Let's have another drink. Or are you already wasted? You're not wasted yet. Let's go back. You are not wasted yet. Let us go back. Irashimase. Yep, next one. The Glen Fiditch 12 Years is the best selling single malt whiskey in the world. This bottle set the industry standard for a single malt. You'll find it light and fresh. The bouquet is fruity and the finish clean, making it exceptionally easy to drink. Its light flavor makes it popular with anyone new to single malt whiskeys. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Now we're drunk. I see you got a steady hand, but I'm, I'm willing to bet a hundred thousand that you can't beat me at count up. Sure. I forgot how to play this game, but let's just do this real quick. the most points you score in three, right? In three rounds. Yeah, you're trash. I don't want to worry about you at all. Damn. That was the alcohol, I swear. Has to be. Oh my gosh, bro. Bro, what are you doing, Majima? You can't. I mean, we're still gonna win, but like, bro, what are what are these scores that I'm doing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Dude, what? Maybe it's the new darts? What up? That was terrible. You can't. We deserve to lose. Cool. I should have lost. <laughs> yep, just scored the highest. Yeah, we should have took an L there. That was so bad. You have won fair and square. Let's do this again. But this time we bet 400,000. I'll buy the drinks too. Are you game? Yeah, let's do it. Ongori wa ee no. Ku. I was already drunk, so I mean, it's not going to change anything. Is this like, um, do I get any kind of achievement, CP, or anything for this, or not really? Is this is a sub story. If not, then I'll probably just stop after this one. Damn. You can't. Nice oh my god.
Okay. All of a sudden, this guy is good, you freaking scammer. My first round was terrible, that's why. We lost because of that first round. Wait, what? The NPC choked. Okay, so, um, was there, would, it, would there have been anything if I would have achieved? Like, would it have given me a CP or, like, a substory or anything if I kept going and actually came for the 1 million? I can't believe I actually won that previous one, though. Like, the, the NPC just choked like crazy. That was wild. Oh. There's that wonderful smell again. Come to think of it, I didn't, I didn't actually get anything to eat last time. We'll wrap up the stream by getting the sub story done. Let's finish up the sub story and then um we'll, we'll, we'll call it a day. Hey, excuse me. Oh, the uh, old batarian strikes again. Well, hello again, eye patch fella. You gotta queue up. I'm the end of the line. Huh? Get real. I ain't letting you pull the same stunt again. What? You gonna cop another feel? I don't come cheap. Yeah, right. They couldn't pay me enough. I hate having to repeat myself, but cutting a line is bad form. Get behind me. Oh, oh hello, Etsuko-san. How's it going? An old Batarian friend? Oh, Michika-san. Isn't this place so tasty? Good. Hey, oi! What do you think you're doing? You get CP for all minigames? Hmm, I see. Well, it's fine. I, with, with, with me drunk like that, already going into a drunk, I don't think I could have got that one million one. So we'll just come back later on and do it. If I lay a hand on her, she'll start shouting the P word again. Good. Look, it's clear as day this time. You cut the line. Now get behind me and wait your turn like a normal person. Huh? So unreasonable. I haven't seen my friend here in ages. Maybe you ought to get that stuck up your, uh, get your stick up your ass checked out, Sonny. I mean, and here the plan was to get his minigame first thing. Laughing my ass off, there's so much to do in this. I know, dude, I'm sorry, okay? The initial plan, I was, the initial plan was to try to get the minigame first thing. I wanted to get his minigame first thing just in case. But there's literally too much to do. There's too much to do in this game, there's too much going on. And they all make it for me to get distracted too easily. Now listen here. Why don't you quit being so damn selfish? The the, the freaking tracker doesn't help any. The the, the sub-story tracker literally didn't help at all whatsoever. Why don't you quit being so damn selfish? Or this? Oh, scary. Perform 10 hat tricks and win 10 million gambling on darts. Win 10 million gambling on darts? I see. What seems to be the problem here, ladies? You gotta help us, officer. The scary fellow is being a real terror to us poor defenseless old ladies. Yeah, we were just chatting with each other when he started shouting obscenities. Huh? Whoa, what? You two windbacks cut in line. Now, now. Why don't you have some candy and calm down a bit? It's as sweet as it comes. You got a candy? What the hell? You think this makes it all better? What am I, five? <laughs> officer, help! Damn it, fine, screw this. He's just a common thug. 
How did I end up getting painted as the bad guy? This old Obitarian is one cunning adversary. Adversary, rather. And sometimes playing minigames unlocks more minigames. Well, isn't that just a minigame exceptional hell? Oh, it's done. It's done again. Uh, well, let's just go to this restaurant for now. Oh my gosh, this place. Everything is in the thousands. Hmm, why not? Oh, because this place doesn't look like it has anything specifically besides just um just to get the to eat all the items. <laughs> what was I supposed to be doing again? Oh yeah, he wanted to check out one of the places, that's right. Uh... Oh, it's back. Perverts! There's a pervert here! Uh. You old shitbag! Who are you calling a perv? Huh, <laughs> <laughs> you fell right into the Obitarian's trap? Uh. Oh. You dumb hag! Now you're really gonna get it? Whoa, now he's crossed the line. Oh, actually, based on the marker, the minigame might actually be the next objective? Wait, what do you mean? Oh, actually, based on the marker, the minigame might actually be the next objective? Okay, so we'll be able to lock it first thing next time. Absolutely, for certainty, we'll be able to get it next time around. <laughs> Nobody gets cute with the Yakuza. B-I-T-C-H. Suck on this. <laughs> um, I need to take- I need to get some sleep. Take care. Okay, Crazy Dread. Take care, fam. Thank you so much for coming to, to the stream. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed. Um, hopefully get to see you again um next Saturday. But um, if not, um, I hope you have a well. I hope you have a good week, regardless. Um, good luck with everything you got going on during the week. Um, and if I happen to not catch you next Saturday, I hope you have a good weekend as well. Um, thank you for coming through today. I hope you enjoyed. Take care, fam. I'm about to end things shortly, anyways. I'm just gonna wrap up this sub story here and then call it a night. Who the f are you? The, the eye patch fella. Hey, I know this old lady's a real pain in the ass, but that don't give you the right to pull a blade on a civilian. Uh. Huh? Hey, buddy. I know how you feel. I really do. I got accused of being a perp, too. But it ain't worth it. Trust me, let sleeping dogs lie. You are no match for the Obitarian. Hell, I ain't either. You trying to tell me what to do? Yo, 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 mosey up to me and tell me I'm no match for some old hag. You don't know shit, friend. The two of you can share a grave. All right, let's go. Time to beat his ass. You got a knife, but I got a baseball bat. Bro, that was so easy. I didn't even blink. You, 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 you ain't bad. Praise is cheap coming from a chump. Now get lost. Tch. You're the bee's knees, I patch fella. Bah. I end up coming to your rescue without even meaning to. I kind of hate myself right now. Well, on closer inspection, you're a fine piece of work. Just like my husband when he was still kind of grabby. My heart's really pounding. Whoa, whoa, dial it down. You're creeping me out, lady. No need for any feminine wiles. Oh, but I've got to repay you to set things right. Feh. Keep your candy, lady. I don't need that sugar high. 
Oh, I had something in mind much sweeter than candy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Come to granny, you fine handsome devil. Whoa! She's too strong. I can't hold her off. Pop the cork too early, sweetie. Nothing to be ashamed of. It's been a while for me, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> Woohoo! Get a room, you two. Hell no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, please, don't tease. <sighs> the guy at the counter was right. The only thing to be gained from getting involved with an Obatarian is misery. The toughest creature under the sun ain't a pro fighter and ain't a Yakuza. Is the Osakan Obatarian? Oh my goodness. <laughs> that was hilarious. That was funny. That was freaking hilarious. Oh my gosh. I did not expect it to end like that. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely wasn't expecting that. Are you, are you kidding me? Let's go ahead and get a couple of drinks real quick. Because we just um, became not, a little bit less intoxicated. So let's just grab a little, uh, a little sun, sun real fast. Top it off. Top off this stream. We almost got them all done. Bomar. Let's get that in. This is the standard of the Bomar line. Sherry barrels give it its uniquely ripe floral overtones. It also has the distinctive seaweed and salt notes of Islay with a distinguished flavor that has earned it the title of Queen of Islay. It stands a cut above the rest of the single malt 12 or your old whiskeys. And we're fully intoxicated again. Maybe I should have gone for the more expensive one. When I see a customer really enjoying a drink, I can't help but offer them to keep uh, more. Uh, I can't offer but to help. Uh, when I see a customer really enjoying a drink, I can't help but offer them more to keep the fun going. And you offer them the most expensive drinks you got. I bet that's a trick I use a lot. <laughs> you know all my tricks. But it's on the house today. If you find something you like, you can order it next time. You're offering me a free tasting session. I ain't gonna say no to that. In that case, let me pour you something special. Try this one. This one's strong, eh? Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Where's it from? It's a scotch whiskey. Valentine, 17 years old. It's held in high esteem worldwide. Must be pretty special. Hi. It's a blend of more than 40 different single malts from all over Scotland. Matured for 17 years. <laughs> Guess that explains the complex taste. A uh, Valentine's 17 years old, huh? The more you know, the more you marvel at all the work that goes into making this stuff. I'm looking forward to our next lesson. Yeah. Perfect. We got that friendship meter up just a little bit more. Is there anything we need to transfer into the item box? This candy from that freaking cougar. Okay. Alright guys, we're gonna wrap it up for today. We are going to wrap it up for today right here. That's another Yakuza stream in the bag. I hope you guys enjoyed and had a great time. I had a phenomenal time. That was lots of fun. Um, I cannot believe we streamed for almost for like basically almost four hours. We did, a, we did a three hour, 45 minute stream essentially, and we didn't even get to where I wanted to. Crazy. Um, but now that I found this freaking tracker for the sub stories, we're gonna be doing a lot a lot of the sub stories as they come. So that's probably gonna put like, you know, a damper on a little bit of the progress that we make during this game as far as the main story goes. But hopefully you guys enjoy it nonetheless, because we do int I do intend on getting them all done at any point. I mean, I mean, I do intend to get them all done anyways, so might as well just do them as we go so that we don't have to do worry about doing every single sub story at the end post game and which might be a little bit more boring um but anyways y'all that's it for today um again regular schedule next week we are back to the regular stream schedule next week wednesday we got unicorn overlord demo um we're going to continue that where we left off with scarlet being kidnapped 
then next Friday is when we're going to come back with more Final Fantasy 7 Crisis Core Reunion. Um, we're going to start off with the next chapter. That game is starting to peak. We have hit a time skip, so that should be interesting. And then um, next Saturday, we'll be back with more Yakuza 0. So hope you guys look forward to it all. But for now, y'all, that is a wrap. That is it. Thank you guys so much for coming through as always. I appreciate you guys. Um, hope you have a great rest of your evening, morning, afternoon, whatever time zones y'all are in. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, guys, because the weekdays is right around the corner once again, unfortunately. Good luck with everything, school, work, family stuff, whatever you guys got going on. And I hope to see you guys next time. Take care, everybody. Your boy's out of here. Peace. Bye-bye. See y'all soon. Take it easy. Bro, what the heck? There, I forgot how to. Oh my gosh, I forgot how to do that.